Hey folks, this is Vince and Natalie with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to play Tropico 6. Uh, we're utilizing the Llama of Wall Street DLC, courtesy of Calypso Media. Um, we've never played multiplayer before, and this is Idalee's first time playing Tropico 6 completely. So, there's going to be some educational things going on here, this is just for fun. Um, we've set up a two-player game. And one thing off the bat I will note is that there's no way to kick anyone, unfortunately. Um, if I click on the person's name in the lobby, nothing happens. So I can't seem to kick people as a host. It just seems kind of silly. Another thing I don't like is that there's no way to see what position 1 is or where position 2 is on the map that you, that you chose. So little things like that, I think, would enhance the gameplay. As far as the Llama of Wall Street DLC, it's 10 bucks on Steam. Um, there's a new standalone mission with that, the Llama of Wall Street. Uh, new buildings, Trade Institute, Toy Workshop, and Smart Furniture Studio. New gameplay mechanics, there are price fluctuations, so goods will raise or lower in price as you play. Uh, new challenges, random events will occur and will have positive, negative, or mixed effects on global market situations. New sandbox map and a new edict, traits, and customization options for El Presidente and your palace. If you want to learn more about that, head on over to the Steam store page, the Llama of Wall Street DLC, 10 bucks. Okay, um, are you good, hun? Are you Yeah. Hun? Okay, I try to put everything on, like, an easier setting as possible, um, mm -hmm. just to give you some leeway. Because I know you've okay. never played this before. But if you have questions... Um... Okay. So how do, how do we start this? Oh, start. There we go. I'm excited. Are you? Yeah. I haven't played Tropical in a really long time. Oh, okay. So, perfect time to learn then. Mm -hmm. You're in the presence of a master. Oh, good. No, not really. Because I am such a noob at this oh, game. Oh, please. You're fine. I built my first building. It's already, like... You're in debt like, by riots, millions of dollars. Like, riots everywhere. Right. Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> Thanks, okay. whoever just uh, subbed, or whoever that was. Oh, Bessa, oh, cool. thank you. Appreciate it. 20 months. Okay, wow. so we're we're cooperative, so you should start... Okay, there you are. You're on the right side. You are you have the green border, oh. and I've got the balloon border. Oh, oh okay, I see. So, it looks like you're you're good to go. Um, my oh, advice is start on start building roads further out. Just sort of expand your empire a little bit. Oh, your town is so pretty. Look at this. Can you see my cursor at all or no? <laughs> mm, no, I cannot see your cursor. No. You are. I see you. Looks like your dock is already set up. You've got some shacks. You've got a... You've got a farm. I click on your farm, but I can't see what it is, or I can't interact with it. So, um... Let's go ahead and just zoom in. Alright, so my advice to start off is build a cash crop or two. So if you okay. right, right clicking should bring up the build menu. Uh, okay. And, oh, okay, yeah. And the second tab over is food okay. and resources, and then you want plantation. Okay, not the coconut harvester? No. I would not do the coconut harvester yet. Is that... Is it's, that up like... to, it's up to you, but <laughs> I would I would think that you'd earn more money. Tobacco and coffee and sugar. Um, I see. I would start with those. Okay. Um, is first... there, like, a preference to put them anywhere other than the green spots? No. I mean, I would stick with the green spots. Um, yeah. Yeah, I would just do that. To see the price of everything, uh, there's a little wheel on the bottom of the screen. Okay. Did you click on the wheel? Did it bring? I clicked plantation. Oh, okay. All right. Click. Wait, where? From where? In the regular? The regular, the regular screen. There should be a bunch of buttons on the very bottom. There's like yeah. Uh, there's yeah. A the, oh, wheel. the shipping, the ship wheel. Yeah, the for ship trade. wheel. Yep. Click on that. Mhm. Mm and then click on the middle tab, goods and prices. I see that. And then. Mm -hmm. The filter on the very right, sort by price. Yep. That oh. will give an indication as what's selling right now. Now, with the Llama DLC, the price will fluctuate. So, oh, um, coffee seems to be lucrative right now. Um, sugar is okay. Tobacco is okay. 
but it seems like coffee might sell for a decent bundle. So if anything, I'd try and do a a coffee plantation if at all possible. Um, I want rum. How do I get rum? <laughs> rum is a factory thing. You have to build a uh, uh, first. First, just worry about the plantations. Yeah, yeah. Did you get a crown demand? Yes. Okay. Always do the crown demands whenever possible so that you can extend your time. On the very bottom left is a timer. Oh, I see. So it's a good idea to... Um, whenever you complete a crown reward... As a reward, pick the 12-month 12 12 extension. That way... Um, that way you have more time to complete this phase of the game. Because if, if time runs out, that's it. That's bad. So, oh my god. Did you get a pirate cove request? I got, I think so. Here, I'll pause it. Did that pause That's for you? It's fine. Uh, I don't know. It's fine. No, no big deal. Okay. I have to build a library within a given. Okay. So, I guess I'll do that. Sure. Um, so, where do I see, like, how many buildings I have and how many... How many buildings um, you have? Yeah, like what type of build? Like all my buildings. Um, I never look at that. Let's see. Um, mm, 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 overlays, almanac. Let's check the almanac. The place where I like to go. Oh, okay, building list. There we go. I got it. So, uh, f let's see. Under the almanac, which is the third button on the very bottom. I see it. Yeah, the building list. Okay. Building list. Oh, okay. So, okay. So, how many plantations? Go for plantations. Um, go to the food and resource button. If you if you go to the building list, yeah. Second one down says plantation, and then click on plantation, and it'll tell it'll drop down into what you have. Probably corn. Yeah, yeah. I was asking how many you had. Oh, I can't see what you have. I, I was. I, I know. I was asking if you had the same one. Like, do you have just the corn yes, plantation? We, yeah, we start with the same things. Oh, okay, I see. Cool. Okay. Alright, let's get to it. I'm All gonna right. build a rum factory, that's my goal. Well, <laughs> you, for, for the rum factory, you need sugar. Sugar converts into rum. Yeah, so I'm gonna would, build you... one of every crop. Alright, now keep in mind, I would only <laughs> go with, like, one or two buildings at a time. Just because okay. uh, your builders take time to build stuff. Yeah. Okay. I got it. Five buildings. Right, five buildings. This is why I'm so bad at this. I'm so impatient. <laughs> it's alright. Ooh, I can research stuff? Cool. Yeah, if you have a library, you can research stuff. Hello, Roblox. How are you? I would just go ahead and pick. Just click on everything in the colonial area, uh, click colonial era window. If you I click see. on the research button. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Uh, it looks like our combined, our goal, the goal that I chose for this scenario mm -hmm. scaled with how many people were playing. Like I oh, chose, wow. I chose 1 million as the goal. Apparently uh, that it it went to two million because we're interesting. Two. Interesting, yeah. So goals scale in this. See, rubber is now trending down. Okay. So when some when something says like that, if you're producing and it's costing more than what you're exporting, you want to shut that factory down, right? The rubber. Mm, no, it, it'll never happen. Oh. I mean, I wouldn't worry about shutting anything down. I would keep everything working. At, you know, just just keep keep it exporting, keep it going, because that's a huge amount of micromanagement that you'd have to keep doing that. Mm. What's your time limit say on the bottom left? Five years, one minute. Oh, okay. Or one month. month. Yeah. <laughs> one minute. I have a quest complete. Do I get ten revolutionary immigrants, yes. two thousand bucks, or a random blueprint? Take the revolutionaries. They will help you uh, win this particular era. Approved portfolio, work mode, in the world. 
I don't know what that. It's a, the work mode is what you can um, you can customize how the building operates. I don't know what building or clicking on though for this. The library. Oh. I clicked on library. Yeah, I would just do the standard one. Whatever the standard one is is fine. Cool. I guess I should build a library myself. Uh, oh, I see. Okay. Oh. Cool. Fulfill export trade route with the crown. Okay. Okay, do you know how to set up a trade route? Uh, I'm sort of getting there. <laughs> okay, you click on the wheel. Yep. And the first tab is trade route offers. You okay, want, yep. You want to pick an export one, the red arrows. You want to pick one of the red... On the left-hand side of each commodity, there's a red arrow going up or a green arrow going down. Okay. The red arrow oh, going up okay. is an export... So pick one that you're producing. Yeah. I, I don't know what you're producing, but you'd want to pick... Okay. Alright, I'll sign it. This is cool. I like this whole trade. What's buying a trade license do? That allows you to get more trade routes. Excuse me, oh, I You only start with the ability to, to sign one trade route. As you go, you can uh, sign multiple trade routes if you buy more licenses. Mm. Really? They want me to build a dungeon? Ugh. Fine. I'll, I'll build it, then demolish it. Oh, what, what was it? Uh, the crown wants me to build a dungeon. Build it? Why not? Because it's an eyesore. So? Something that you have. <laughs> yeah. It's 3,000 bucks, too. I wow. I'll just put it over here. <laughs> Crooked roads all over again. Oh, great. Another thing I would check to see is how many unemployed you have. Okay. Do you know how to do that? Go to your almanac, which is the third button on the bottom. Uh-huh. Third tab over is people. Homes. Half Homeless families. Oh, my lord. No, okay. don't worry about that. Halfway down is jobs. Oh, okay. Unemployed, vacant jobs. Oh, I see. You want to keep your unemployed somewhere around, you know, zero to five, vacant jobs, zero to five. So you're trying to balance things out. If you have a lot of unemployed, that means you want more buildings to fill those jobs. And that's good because people people earn wages when they work and they can live in but, better housing. I see. But don't you need to put them in housing? Like, well, don't you, you don't want them homeless or what? Well, if they're homeless, they'll just build shacks and shacks reduce your housing score. That's what you're... There's, a, there's satisfaction in this game, housing satisfaction. Okay. And I guess go ahead and click on the... If you click on the almanac again... Mm-hmm. And on the first tab, there's happiness. Yeah. Click on overall happiness. Okay. And you should see a bunch of things. Food, health care, fun, faith, housing, job, liberty, crime, safety. Okay. Do you see all there's that? Yeah. Okay. That basically means um, there's a housing score. And your shacks are like bottom of the barrel quality. Mm -hmm. So by giving people jobs, you're giving people money. And with that money, they can afford better housing. Which you can put down for them at some point. Okay. And that will increase your housing score. That's why... Other, if, if they don't have any money, they'll just they'll just build shacks wherever they want. Does that make any sense? It does. So it's it's similar to the other truck goes. Yeah, absolutely. Cool. Trying to produce fish. <laughs> I'm going to talk in Spanish. That's <laughs> for this. For a minute, game. I was thought you're a Russian. Okay. <laughs> I know, right? It isn't. How is it that I'm Spanish and I cannot do my accent. <laughs> I know, what's up with that? That's so weird. 
Comrade. <laughs> That's so sad. <laughs> Oops. Okay. So you can upgrade buildings here. Take it. Oh. I'm gonna up. Are we are we in the World Wars or no? We're in the Colonial Era. Colonial. Yeah, we won't get out of that until um, we we satisfy the Crown's objectives, which is we either pay off the Crown or go to war. I just pay them off with money. That's all. I see. Which is pretty easy to make if you do it right. Yeah. So should I build more housing then? Um, it's up to you. I mean, should what do I you pay? need? Do you, how much unemployed do you have? 58 oh yeah build build don't build housing Thanks. build build stuff that will make you money more plantations oh, okay. more ranches um ways to feed the people okay if you have a sugar plantation um you can build a rum distillery keep forgetting what buildings i have and don't have it's all right it takes it takes some time Ew, why do I have two corn plants? Oh, how do I change? How do you change it? Yeah, like how do I change the resource? Oh, I found it. I've... Yeah, if you oh. click, uh, there's a button called change resource on the bottom right of the window. Did you find it? Yeah. Okay. Oh, it stinks that I gotta pay money to change it. Not only that, but the resource might not be good there. Yeah. I was going through it. I think I'm good now. Okay. <laughs> Over overloading right now. <laughs> no, there's a lot to do. Piña. I want to make some piña colada. Take a minute and see how you're doing. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, you've got a lot of plantations. You've got... Do I, I still need more? You got a chapel already, I see. Do I? I guess. I didn't, I didn't build it. <laughs> I must say I'm... Figure out where to put this... Thing. What's your uh, mandate at? Two years. Okay. Oh, really? Okay. What What's your crown objective? Uh. On the left hand side, there should be a bunch of quests. Produce corn. For him. Um. That's for one of them. Oh, for the crown trade route, you mean? Okay. Or what? Yeah, the crown trade route. What are you? What was the goal there? It just says fulfill an export trade route with crown. Zero out of one. And I thought I had a trade route. Because if that timer reaches zero, then it's game over. It's yeah. instant lose. Figured. Oh crap, how do I delete? Delete what? trying to build the stupid road it's all crooked <laughs> um if you go to construction oh, I got it. there's a demolish on the first tab yeah under traffic and infrastructure um let's let's figure out what's going on with your let's build another dungeon you gotta be kidding me okay um <laughs> it says the crown trade route just fulfill an export trade route with the crown is that a specific trade um, go to your trade window. I'm, mm -hmm. gonna, I'm gonna pause the game here. Just so we don't lose. I'm uh, exporting 241 out of 325. Oh, okay. So you're almost done with that. Yes. I guess. My revolutionary's approval is 53 out of 60. Okay. And I have to produce a thousand corn. <laughs> so, sure. Okay. So as long as you're exporting coffee... 
in completing mm -hmm. that objective. I'm trying. I have to. Well, I have to wonder if I should put more coffee down then to complete it faster. Mm. No. The thing is, you have limited room, though, right? Yeah. I'm gonna try and get one of each uh thing. Demand co oh. All right, so now it's three years and ten. Okay, so you you're. So you're up to three years now. You'll get another quest from him. Let me know whatever it is, and I'll help you get it done. I must say what? I have, like, an exclamation point on my trading thing. How do I get rid of that? That means that your trade route was completed, and you can go for another one. So go back to your wheel, the ship wheel on the bottom. Yeah. And then go to trade route offers. Okay. Find a red arrow pointing up. Is, it, is there one for coffee there? One for pineapple. I have pineapple. Are you Are you growing pineapple right now? Yes. Okay. Then, yeah, whatever one looks good to you. Go ahead and ex make sure it's an export, not an import. Yeah. A red arrow, right? Yeah. Hmm. Increases efficiency on nearby pineapple plantations. Now, it does... Does that upgrade only affect its own building, or does it only affect, um... It should affect does its it own only, building. Does it, I meant, I meant, because this one says it increases efficiency on nearby pineapple plantations by 3%. Does it include its own building? Pretty sure. I wouldn't know that for sure, unless it said it. Hmm. How's your money going? I guess it's going okay. 98,000 and rising. Good. I wish it had like a plus to let you know whether it was, whether the profit was increasing or decreasing. Mm. Looks fine to me. I mean, that's... Mm. Oh, the music is so good. I have this stream safe music on, so, like, it's pretty repetitive. <laughs> Aww. Oh no, I did this wrong! Well, you did the right. Just house. Oh, it's still wrong! Um... I don't like the building, um, the roads and stuff, like the layout. It's weird. You don't? Yeah, because I leave a square empty for a road, but it will not build that road in there. Oh, um, it depends on what you're trying to do. Um, where, where at? By your dock? Yeah, it was just, I had to move the plantation one over. I had to, like, cancel the construction and then rebuild it. I see. Silly. Well. No big deal. Alright, so I have to build a pirate cove. <laughs> okay. Is that, that's not the dungeon you were talking about. No, it's a separate, you'll be able to conduct raids from there to get different things. It's pretty fun. Cool. More, Governor, more, always more. Does this go in water? Is what? Does this go in water? Does what go in Must water? Must be placed on a beach. Oh, I have to place it on a beach. Yeah. Mine's right next to my dock in case you're wondering what it's supposed to look like. Uh, 
Oh, okay. Facing them. <laughs> yeah, the 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 dock end is supposed to go onto the land, and the big part is is supposed to go in the water. Nice. Hmm. Man. How many fishing wharfs do you have now? I'm sure you got like a bunch. I have zero. <gasps> Why? I only build what I need. Just because of the limited space. How come... How come... I, when you build the fishing wharf, right? Okay. There's a huge green... Um, area. Like, okay. there's green areas where fish are, but my boats aren't sailing to it. Catch the fish. Mm, just watch them over time. Make sure it does. I mean, are, are you getting any hits? Only shellfish. Not fish. Well, that, I think that's right. But it says fish. Oh, oh, I see. Okay. So they are fishing. Very yeah, they, they should be. I see. I'm just impatient. <laughs> it takes some time. Why is... <laughs> I feel like building my pirate cove way out. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Because it's fun. I, I like it to be like a little secret place. But then if you do that, they take forever. Again. Probably. Yeah, you want it. You want stuff relatively close so that you can get. Um. Crap! I hate that. You know, I'll just. It's nice to have choices, isn't it? How? What's your time at now? Ooh, one year, nine months. Oh, jeez. What's your What's your objective? Bad. You gotta do a trade. Do something that you're selling a, a ton of. I'll go ahead and yep. slow down time here. Because I'm at nine years. Oh my lord, how do you get so fast? By completing their objectives. That's what I'm trying to do. I still gotta build that pirate. Oof. Well, I'd and worry, what, worry what about the him first. What do the immigrants do? What do you mean immigrants? The ten revolutionary immigrant rewards. So that, that's what I've been picking. That's, that help, that's gonna help you get past this era. How? It's one of your objectives. Uh, <coughs> Excuse me. It's one of your objectives. You have to get 60 revolutionaries to cue the last part of this era. Oh, I see it. But what, what, you said you have to complete a trade route. What trade route are you doing right now? A coffee trade route. It says I can declare independence and pay the crown, or I can declare independence and prepare for war. Um,. How many? How much time do you have left? Um, one year, six months. You know, what, let's go ahead and spend the fifteen thousand and just de just declare independence. Okay. That that gets rid of the time limit, and now we're on to the World Wars era. Mm. So now there's no time limit. I, I hate the colonial time limit. I really do. <laughs> Cool. Okay. Now that that is out of the way. One thing to worry about is your support. Make sure you've got a little bit of support. What's your support percentage right now? I have no idea. Upper left-hand corner, there's a little check mark with a percentage. Um... Seven percent. Seven? 
8%. Okay, let's get that up immediately. Um, I'm pausing. Uh, I have, okay, I'm picking my voting rights. I don't know which one to do. Just do all... Well, it's up to you. I would do all citizens vote. Okay. And my armed forces professional soldiers? I just do middle. If you do middle of the line... Just, I would do middle of the line for everything. Unless you want to split. <laughs> Pacifist state. Disables all military buildings. Decreases the rebel threat. Wow. That looks like a good one, right? It's up to you. <laughs> I do I do middle of the line. That's not to mess with anything. Alright, militia. <laughs> Confirm. Sure. Okay, so why is my support so low? Well, let's take a look at it. Click on your support percentage. Okay. And click on oh. p uh, click on happiness, second tab over. Okay. Oh, wait, what's your food rating at? 49. That's good. Healthcare? 16. All right, we need to increase that. Um, what else? Fun? Um, okay, hold on. I'm, let me try to build a house, uh, a church, or a clinic, or whatever. It's a clinic that you need for that. So let's yeah. go ahead and build a clinic. If we go to public services... Oh, I have to unlock the blueprint. Okay. Yeah, it's... it's I got it. Alright, I don't know. I usually build two of them if I have the money. Two? Yeah. Wow. Because with this population this size, one clinic isn't going to be enough. Only ten people can visit a clinic at a time. You've got 120 people on your island. You've got a lot I of see. sick people, basically. Where the heck is my road? Like, how am I supposed to figure out... There, some what... buildings don't need a road connection, so put it anywhere. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I dig if that. It, if it doesn't have a red arrow with a road, then just put it anywhere. Oh, cool. Okay, so then I guess I'll build a clinic. Maybe next to a pirate cove. <laughs> I, yeah, put it... Yeah, whatever. I, I put the I put clinics next to housing, wherever people are living. Where all the shacks are and stuff. Okay. So good. Oh! Oh, crap, nuggets. There we go. Another clinic, you say? I would do two, but that's just me. You do you. <sighs> How much money do you have? 102,000. Okay, that's fine. Is that yeah, it's good plenty. or no? Yeah, it's plenty. Okay. They call me the... So, um, now let's go, whenever you're done, go back to yeah. your almanac, almanac, and then happiness tab, second one over. So your Fun health- Fun is at 24. Alright, let's increase that. So let's go, right click, and go to, um, entertainment. Oh, I see. Personally, I would go with the circus. Really? Mm -hmm. Not the tavern? The, I, yeah, I have a tavern already, but the circus holds more people, and uh, the satisfaction is better. Nice. So, uh, this is another building that doesn't need a road, so just throw it anywhere. Okay. Oh. Where to put any of this stuff? Tavern right next to the library. Yeah, it's fine. People can drink and read at the same time. <laughs> Alright. Um, in the circus, unlock the blueprint. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. So the, that reward get a random blueprint is just... Yeah, it just, it just unlocks a random building, which I don't like. I wish I could I see. Interesting. I guess the circus... Be behind the mayor's or the president. El presidente's house. El presidente's house. Canal Uno investigates the underwater menace. Later, Atlantis fish people, the real okay. underwater menace. Okay. Alright, so when you're done with that, go back to your mm -hmm. happiness tab. Yep. Faith is at what? Around 37 or so? Uh, 35. Uh, that's good for right now. Um, really? Yeah, I mean, you've already got a chapel. We'll build a church. Do I? Well, yeah, yeah. Where do I sit my chapel? Say what? Where do I see my chapel? Um, go to your island. It should be like a little graveyard in the middle of, dead middle of your town. It's by your corn uh, farm. Oh, okay. Interesting. 
So you already have one, which is good. Um, if you... Let's see if we can build a church or not. Um, do we want to spend six grand on a church? Up to you. Yeah, one. All right. Although, I'm I'm already building like one, two, three, four <laughs> buildings. It's all right. I'm just trying to take into account what you said earlier to build so much, but right. Well, you've, you I should guess have I like need it. yeah, four or five buildings right now. Well, yeah, we're gonna. I mean, this is we'll just have to wait a while and let our workers build all of these structures, mm -hmm. and then once they're done, yeah, then we'll be free. We just have to make sure we're not building anything else for a while. Yeah. Let them is this up. sandbox mode? Um, no. Well, yeah, it's sandbox mode. There's no, there's no objective other than to just earn money. This is multiplayer co-op sandbox. All right. Okay. Did you build your church? I'm trying to figure out a place to put it. Okay. Okay, I built it. Okay. So go back to your happiness tab. Okay. Uh, what's job say? Job is 28. Okay. Um. I have 45 people unemployed. Well, yeah, so with you building all these structures, that'll take care of that for the most part. Because you're going to oh, get more people. Yeah, more people are going to be working at these buildings that you're building. So that'll take care of itself. Liberty is at mm -hmm. what? Uh, Liberty is at 58. That's good. Crime safety? 58. That's good. All right. So let's just close and I'll hit play again. And okay. we'll, we'll let these buildings construct. And that should raise our scores considerably. Cool. Ideally, you want 50% or higher support. Okay. If it drops below that, let me know. Okay. Now, do these contracts have um Which contract? A, the broker uh, contract? Like all these trade route contracts? Okay. Do they oh, have okay. time limits? No, but what I would do to keep them happy, mm -hmm. um, there's U.S. and, or there's allies and Axis. Mm -hmm. There's two groups. If yeah. you make one angry and they invade you, game over. So okay. you want, I what I do is I trade one to one, trade one to the other one. That way you're getting, because if you look on the bottom right, it says relation modifiers. Oh. It says like plus five to the allies and minus two to the Axis or vice versa. Wait, where do I see that? Uh, open your trade route offers. Yeah. Bottom right, relation modifiers. In the trade route? Mm-hmm. Offers? Click click on a commodity. Click on, say, oh. click on any commodity. Oh. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. So also, you, they're icons. Right. So oh. it'll say, like, plus five to this faction, minus two to this faction. Oh, interesting. So, ideally, you want to trade to each one to offset that negative. Mm. And you'll earn a little bit doing so. Um, another thing you're going to want are two embassies. That way you can see... That way you can interact with both of them. Okay. Um, I'm going to actually do that now. I'm going to unlock both the... Uh, I'm going to unlock the embassy structure and put two down. What is the blue... The radius uh, overlay, yeah. What does That's that mean? in case in case you have to put something inside their radius. Like one of their demands might be, I want a restaurant near my embassy. That uh, tells seriously? you, yeah. Sometimes you'll get that. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I guess it could be kind of cool. For what? For an embassy. For, like, that kind of gameplay mechanic. It, it'll just... It's more micromanagement. It I is. Think. I mean, th you had this in Tropico 5 as well. Did I? I don't remember. <laughs> I haven't played in so long. Mm. Okay. 
I'm still trying to get my plantation. <laughs> Your plantation? What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, like I'm trying to get one of each plantation. Oh, don't worry about that. that. Yeah, fo remember, you're focusing on the happiness right now. Yeah. <laughs> so let your, so let, your let your builders um, construct all the things that you were building. Yeah. And then you can worry about... And plus, not one of everything is good, because papaya may not sell for a whole lot. Or, mm -hmm. you know... That's labor that you're using that you could use for something else that's more lucrative. Hmm. Are you raiding at the moment? No. With your pirate Is code? it good to raid? On the very bottom, there should yep. be a, a little flag with an exclamation yep. point. Yep. Yeah, this is free money. Uh, uh, click on click on the pirate raid button, and then the second tab over on the top is Pirate Cove. Oh, I see. Um, I would advise coffee, corn, and gold. Why? Because gold sells for a lot, coffee selling for a lot. When you loot it, you're getting free stuff. You can turn right around and export that if you have too much of it, and you'll get money doing it. There's no sense in looting bananas, hides, and iron if the prices are low. But we do know that cool. gold sells for a lot. We know that coffee sells for a lot. So that's what I've been doing. I've been looting coffee, corn, and gold. Blockade Dad's Gaming Addiction. <laughs> oh, that's nice. No, no, I'm not going to do that, but I think that's funny that that's in there. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's funny. I'm also going to rescue Educated from time to time. Oh. Just so I can get some high school and college workers into my into my city. That way, when I build high schools and colleges, they'll be able to work there and teach others to be smart. What are raid points? Oh, that's what it costs. Yeah, it costs to conduct raids. How do you get them? Um, By raiding. Certain certain raid. raids get like certain things give you raid points. Others take it away. Mm. Interesting. Okay, so coffee, corn, and gold. You say? Yeah. I, Do it. Well, it's up to you. Uh, mm -hmm. Look at look at the prices. Right mm -hmm. now, um, let's see. Weapons are the highest. Cigars, boats, rum, gold. Uh, so gold is high right now at eight thousand nine hundred and fifteen per set. Um. Looks like coffee's down to three thousand. Yeah, I would I would do that, but it's up to you. Um, yeah, my my it. next okay. <laughs> I'm gonna want a cigar factory here pretty soon because cigars are because cigar. cigars Wait. are selling for a lot of money right now. Oh, I see. Okay. And that needs tobacco, so you need a tobacco farm to do that. Yeah, you should build a school, right? Um, I would I would focus on your you're getting people that's what that rescue educated is. You you can get high school and college people by doing that rescue raid. Mm -hmm. Um high schools and colleges don't earn you money and they're they're a money sink because of they're they're just there to earn you educated workers. You should be down to like under fifty thousand or so. Are you well, how much money do you have? Uh eighty one thousand. Okay. So I'll just alternate, um, coffee and rescue. It's down to 13%. What is? My, my support. Okay, is it? It was at 20 and now it's at 11. That's weird. What are you doing that's making everyone so mad? I don't know. <laughs> my, my healthcare went up. What's your, How over do I... what is your overall happiness at? 40. Okay. Well, that's good. And that... Let's see. Indifferent, communist, military, religious. Um, if you click on that support button, look under factions. What does it say? Oh. Capitalist... Wait. Wait, where? Click on your support button in the upper left, where the percentage is. Um... Okay. Did you click on it? It says yeah. politics. Support. Yeah. Okay. Undecided 59. Support 22. Opposition is 19. Okay. That's a problem. So <laughs> support. If you look above capitalists, what's your happiness rating? Like what's your, what's. What's 56. What, 50, oh, 52. 52. That's fine. What's religious? 
58. Communists. 47. Military. 45. Huh. That's weird that you have... I right, click on eligible voters on the bottom. Um Did you I wonder did you did you have to set a difficulty for yours? It's weird no. that cuz you have a yours seem to be a lot harder than me. Like uh, like Do not panic, I'm tempted to go upstairs and see what the heck's going on with your game. <laughs> Maybe I'm just not accepting enough missions or something. I don't know. No. I have to choose a side now. Allies or axes? Oh, it's just to accept. I mean, it, you're not doing anything with it yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's fine. Whatever. Well, if you get voted out of office, I mean, I'm just saying that's bad. Nah, well, they'll love me. Uh huh. <laughs> They call me the. Do any of these offers? I love the graphic. Did you build you your embassies already? I'm building my second one. Okay. Click on the first one that's built. Okay. And choose either allies or access on it. Okay. That way it doesn't you... really matter, does it? No, you're gonna put the other one in the other one. Yep. Some say that while there are okay. main nations, I'm oh shoot! Ah, I clicked too fast and I exited out that one pop up. It's all right. He's like Prezi. He was, he didn't <laughs> even finish it. Prezi. Prezi. <laughs> What's your unemployed at? If you go to your almanac and then people. Um, my unemployed is... Mm -hmm. Dude, dude, 27. Unemployed, 27? Vacant mm -hmm. jobs around zero? Okay. Was your El Presidente, did you pick a trait or something that was... I picked Charismatic. What was what, what was the Charismatic trait? What it just that? increases uh, the faction by two. Oh, okay. For the allies and Xyz, I guess. Okay. Hold on, I'll check it in two seconds. Take your time. Ah, enemies all around. I shall defeat you all. My trait is just kind of normal. Oh, I see. Charismatic. Increases the standing with each faction by two and the relations with each superpower by two. That's good. Mm-hmm. Sure. Hmm. Homeless citizens, 44. Oh. Do you have money to build housing? I have 74k... Right. Is that good? Yeah, I would go with some bunk houses. It, it's not great, but um, that'll improve. No apartments. Apartments are for the well-off, and how many of those well-off things do you have? How do I check that? Certain buildings will give well-off. It, it depends on their wage. Um, if you click on say. Just trying to find a good... Okay. Visitors... Click on your circus. Yes. Okay. See where it says wage, $7. Um, mm -hmm. And then visitors, required wealth, poor. So bunk houses have a required wealth of poor. So, oh, I see. Whereas your apartments have a required wealth of, like, wealthy. So not everyone... I mean, you could build an apartment or two, but not everyone's going to move into it because they can't afford it. Yeah, so I, yeah, that's why I start with bunk houses, because okay, makes sense.
Oh, cool! You can build bridges! Yep. Oh, that's really sweet. Twenty percent. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's at twenty seven percent now. No, eleven. <laughs> oh my gosh! Well, people love me. Housing is at thirty two. That's my lowest happy thing. I'm just trying to Housing. figure out what. Who you get made so angry that... <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> so good to see you. Hello, Zerdy, how are you? You can always bribe people that are opposed to you. If, if, if push came... But it's 3,000 to do it. Yeah, ooh, 7%. I'd really like to know... Where's... What, what are you doing... Where's... Where's my political standing? Like, how do I... Click on your, uh, click on your support percentage. Oh, 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 I think I saw it. Relation at 60... Okay, alright. And politics. It's a quick... It's the fifth tab on the top. If you click on your support percentage, it should be under politics. And then on the oh. very bottom it says support. Eligible voters, support, undecided, opposition. Yeah. Ugh. What's your support and what's your opposition? 9% support, opposition 26. Wow. Well, we, we're going to lose, so um, I guess I got to no. figure out... Well, I just got to figure out what's going on with you, that's all. Um, let me come up there and see what's going Demand on. Demand timed out. Minus 5 communist standing. That would do it. Um, what demands Wait. are you timing out? I don't know. The man who built his house on a <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> It just says, fulfill an export trade route with Axes, and that's actually, I should probably do that. Trade route again. Oh yeah. Presidente, your aid is Anytime you get a quest that increases standing, take it. Don't- if you turn down quests, people- the factions will get mad at you, so you don't want that. Yeah, I figure. I don't have a lot of quests. I have- just the Axis trade route and the rescue mission. And the okay. Superpower Alliance. That's it. I haven't been getting a lot of quests. Alright, let me come up there real quick. I just want to see mm -hmm. what you're doing. Okay. And I'll be right back, folks. <laughs> Actually, I'll just let this run. I need the help, apparently. Well... <laughs> <laughs> Should I get a ranch?
Okay. You still there? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um... Yeah, I'm hoping that bribe action would work. Uh, yeah, there, there's no reason why your support should be that low. I, I looked and double-checked. Couldn't mm -hmm. figure out why your support was that low. It shouldn't be. Mm. I wonder if it's a bug with multiplayer or... I don't know. I thought I was doing good, but... No, you are doing fine. I bet you if you played single player, um, you'd be fine. <laughs> so there's definitely something wrong with... I think there's something wrong with the game or... There's some sort of bug with multiplayer. Which stinks. Fire is raging in Tropico. Oh no, so I have to build a fire station? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's just a bunkhouse. That's fine. <laughs> oh, it's just a bunkhouse. It's just someone's house. Yeah. Di demand timed out. Minus two. What are all these demands that are timing out? I don't. Uh, that's what's doing it. On the you, you, you're getting quests. Um, are you getting quests? And you're just not, not. A... I only see four. Is there like a quest book? On on the left hand side, you should see things popping up. Yeah, I only saw four. Like this whole time. Um, are you not getting any other... No, I don't get anything. I don't get that much. So you should be getting a ton of quests. I bet you that's what it is. That's why your, your satisfaction is tanking. Your support. Mm. You I don't... You're not I don't see... I'm not getting quests. Like, a lot. I've only... It's just like once in a blue moon. And you're not clicking through them at all? Like, by accident? No. Alright. Yeah, like right here, this little quest book thing. I have four. That's it. I've been having four for the long time. What are your four quests right now? Money, the money to get two million, that money quest. Okay, and then below that, Superpower Alliance. Superpower Alliance, and then an Axis demand, fulfill export trade route with Axis. Okay. And then com complete a rescue raid from the Pirate Cove. And that's it. Okay. Do any of these offers look good to you? They're all strictly legitimate. I think that's why your your satisfaction is so low. Your you, these quests mm -hmm. that you're, the you should be getting um, quests from like military, from religious leaders asking for things. Mm. And if you don't, if you ignore them, then they time out, and then you lose five standing with that faction. Oh, I, see. I bet you that's what it is. And for whatever I reason, don't, you're not I'm getting not these getting quests. Any of it. No. That's definitely a bug. I wonder if there's a way. Oh, you know what? Mm. Is that is that why I see like my president palace? I have like these icons above it, and they're like they look like yellow people icons with an exclamation point or something. Yeah, Do I have to click that? Well, no, that that should be mad people. I think. I bet oh. those are faction. That, uh, those are people writing like. Oh, okay. I thought those were the quest givers. I just haven't been clicking no. on them. No, that should, that, that should pop up automatically. These quest mm. givers. Like, it should be a window that just pops up saying, El Presidente, we need this, or we need this, or whatever. Mm. No, the last one was that pirate cove. I came to see you as soon as I found these were available, Presidente. What do you think? Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. What happens. What's it at now? Eight. Eight percent. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'll just kill off everyone. That's nice. <laughs> Alright, so I just completed that pirate one. Okay. And it's what at 4%. <laughs> well, what, did, what was the quest? It was just to rescue people. Okay. I don't think that was even a faction type of quest. No, I don't think so either. <laughs> did you move on from the colonial era? Are you at the World Wars era now? Mm-hmm. Okay, just making sure. Mm-hmm. I guess my advice is just keep trying to make people happy as best as possible. Um, yeah, I'm trying. Concentrate on their happiness area, um, housing. Mm -hmm. if, you, if you have a police station yet, go ahead and build a police station for... Criminal safety kind of thing. Yeah. If there's any edicts that would make people happy. Like, you have a lot of farms, right? Yeah. Oh, I just got one. So I have to build a Teamsters office. Alright, hit accept. Don't yeah, cl I don't did. close it. Yeah. I didn't. I actually clicked out of it when I was trying to click through the almanac, but then I went back to the exclamation point quest book thing. Okay. So. That, that might be what... You might be clicking through important windows. I don't know. But they... But I see them on the on the left, you know? I haven't okay. seen anything left. So okay. even if I clicked out of it... Alright. They were still showed up, you know? Um, yeah, do those as quickly as possible to increase your score. Um, yep. Also, I would do... Nah, nah, forget it. I'm looking for stuff that would increase... As much as... Do you know what is popular with the people? Work is hard, and nobody appreciates. Now, does high priority and normal priority and low priority does that affect their happiness? For what? When you build something, the no. construction. No, it doesn't. Put things on high priority if no. they need them. Nope. Yeah, high priority simply means if you've got 15 buildings being constructed, it'll mm -hmm. go to the high priority ones first. That's all okay. that is. Goats, do they produce milk? Uh, I believe so, yes. What's your, um... What's your standing with your two military powers? My two military powers? Well, you yeah. mean the communists and the militarists? No, the Axis and the Allies. Oh, they're they are at one sixty relation. You said fifty one. Sixty, sixty one. Okay. okay, that's good. Yeah, you want to keep them 60. up there. That's good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I typed it. <laughs> I didn't see it. 
Oh, bottom right. <laughs> I see. 61 mm -hmm. and 60, I see. Thanks, that's very helpful. You're welcome. All right, so I chose plus five military standing. Yes, always as my choose reward. the plus five. Yeah, always go with the military standing stuff. Yep. So now I'm at eight percent. Good. That's great. <laughs> oh, I have to export planks, so I have to build. Who would need you to do that? Uh, uh, the broker guy. Oh, th don't worry about that. You can you can deny him. You can, you oh, can, really? yeah, the broker just gives you Swiss money. If, if you, but is it good to make planks though? Yeah. Do you have a logging camp? Not yet. Okay. Yeah. If you have a lot of people that need work, then yeah, build a logging camp and then. Are these trees finite? Like yeah, if I built yes, a logging tree? But they, uh... they should replant them. Oh, okay. There should be a replant mode. I wish you could like build on the water. Like I wish you could terrain the terrain. <laughs> you can I mean adjust the terrain. Yeah, I wish you could terrain the terrain. Terrain the terrain. I, I wish I could verb the noun really bad. <laughs> I want to fish the fish so bad. Uh -huh. Yeah. Totally. I, I hate this. I hate the road layout, the road building in Tropico. You don't it's like the it? one complaint I have about this game. Yeah. So yeah, I'm not getting it anything yet. Okay. I'm I'm looking on the Reddit and it looks like some people are saying fix multiplayer. It's unstable, unpredictable and will kill the game. Mm. So apparently this is this is a known issue. Rough. And it, it it sucks. It really does. But I'm glad I'm able to test it out. You know. Mm. Yeah, I, I think cuz that, that's definitely I mean if missions are not showing up for you as they should be, and they're just timing out, then that means that that's there's an issue. Yeah. Oh, I wish it, I wish there was like, Cause like a building that gives it, you know, or a, Remember the yeah. Story of the man I don't know. Who built his house quest. <laughs> you got a quest? No, I wish I had a quest building where I could just like. Do you have any Swiss money to spend on faction increases? Oh, I can do that? Mm -hmm. How do I do that? Go to your broker, bottom right-hand corner. Okay. Um, the offer... Fair. Do you see under the mm -hmm. offer tab? There's like... I don't know what's there, but... Um, you'll be able to spend Swiss money here. Sometimes there'll be... Sometimes there'll be offers to increase faction rating or whatnot, but that's only if you have Swiss money. Yeah. So certain, cool. yeah, certain quests that you do. Oh, cool. So I could spend 5,000 to increase military standing. 5,000 uh, Swiss? Mm-hmm. I only have 2,000. I didn't think you have, yeah. I can log it for 500. Because there's a timer, it seems. Yeah, it'll refresh. Cool. That's really cool, though. 
And you can unlock more broker quests by spending... Um, if you go to requests, the third tab... Yeah. There's active, and then, like, unlock slot. Yeah. You can spend Swiss money to unlock more slots, which means more broker quests at once. See, why can't they do that with military standing type of quest? Mm. Like, standing well, factions. I agree. Um, another thing, though, is that I like the fact that you can spend Swiss money on something now. Before, Swiss money was unusable, except as an in-game score kind of thing. Now yeah. there's actually a purpose for it, which is cool. Mm-hmm. Like, Swiss money was used for things back in the day. That It was used to to adjust the gameplay. Mm. Kind of, you know, like if you didn't want to send your military off to a quest or your daughter or whoever off to a quest, right? Then this was that's right. Yeah, yeah, family and tropic. That was stupid. The family yeah, system, I didn't. I didn't care for it. I didn't like it either, like, but it was something. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got another one produced canned goods. Damn it, I don't have canned goods. Um, you'll need a cannery. Now, is that a broker quest? No, that's a communist. Okay, then you'll want to do it. You need a power plant and a can a cannery. Cannery. Hopefully, I'm making money. <laughs> How much money do you have? I don't understand where I put this. Fifty-five thousand. Okay. I'll just cannery and what else did a I need? A power plant. Fine. It's on the first tab. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Huge. Any of these offers look good to you? No, you'll have to make you'll have a you'll need coal, I think, to make it work. <laughs> so after you put that down, build a mine. A coal mine. There should be coal somewhere on your island. Now, does this game do like the other game where it'll demolish certain parts of the field of the plantation if you build on it? Yes, you don't want to build over your plantations. Oh, it does do it. I wish you can lock that in so it doesn't do that. Mm. You can also use your raid option to import coal that way, but... I would still put a, a coal mine down. Yeah. Cool. Another day, another so the power plant is the one that gets the coal. No, the power plant generates the power. It consumes coal. So, so I probably should have put my power plant closer to the coal thing. No, nah, it'll drive over. Um, I Put your power plant somewhere central, because it has a radius. Oh, crap. Okay. Like, put your cannery next to your power plant if you can. If not, don't worry about it. You can use a substation to extend the power network. But... How do I... S How do you right. what? Um, no, I was going to ask, how do I see the radius of the power plant? If you click on it, it should give you a, a red, yellow, or green radius. Where are you at? I got your power plant there, I think. Or is that your coal? I, my my power plant is, is loading, or is building, so oh, I, I can't it. see the radius. I see it. It's fine. No, that's good. It's nice and central. I have and to build another circus for the religious standing. Okay, go for it. Yeah, keep keep up with those religious standings. What a great day, Presidente. Uh
Having two circuses isn't too bad, right? No, that'll increase your fun by a lot. Your right. entertainment value. Now, I don't want to alarm you, but I'm going to need a rather prompt decision on these offers. I still don't see that red, the radius for the power. Um, Does it have to be, actually have no. coal in it in order to see the maybe. radius? Yeah, maybe. We'll find out in a minute. There should be an overlay for it somewhere. Hmm. Yeah, click actually click on the fourth button over on the bottom. It says overlay. Oh. And then electricity is the second one down on the right. Oh, interesting. Oh, okay, that's helpful. Always a pleasure doing business with you, Prep. Poor dog. <laughs> I think he's scared her. <laughs> Why am I? Trade routes not fulfilling. Depends on what it is you're, what you have. Um, so, what are your trade routes right now? Um. Go to your go to your trade route section. Tobacco and corn. Do you have a cigar factory? I thought tobacco was from the plantation. I know. Do you have a cigar factory? Yes or no? No, I said. So you don't need... Okay, so tobacco then should export then. Yeah. Um, go to... On the active trade route, What's how many has been delivered? None. Zero out of something? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, it's either because you don't oh, have... Oh, because I'm stupid. I don't have tobacco. I thought I did. Okay. That's the other option. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Why am I not delivering this tobacco? Why am I not exporting <laughs> the product that I'm not growing? Oh my gosh. Mm. What a world, what a world. <laughs> uh oh. Did you get that? What? No, I didn't get anything. Upcoming elections? No. Okay. Did you get that? Well, no, I'm still building. It hasn't popped up for me because I'm building. Uh, tobacco uh, factory. Uh, right. I will deliver an amazing speech, allow them to vote, but I'm too tired to talk to them, or it's not a good di time. Minus 10 personal experience. Try to give us try to give a speech and see what you can do to increase it. Ten immigrants? What, what? Oh wait, I have an I have a reward. Should I get still get ten immigrants or money? For what? This quest completion for the Axis demand trade route. What be your choices? Two thousand bucks, a random blueprint, or ten immigrants. I would. It depends. What do you need right now? Money, or do you need immigrants, workers? I, what do immigrants do? Just workers. increases population. Yeah, population. Mm -hmm. Yeah, why not? Maybe they'll vote for. Me. <laughs> okay. Election speech. Okay. This is a good opportunity to get undecided voters on your side. Please select the highlights of your speech. Okay. Um. I. Crap, I don't know. <laughs> what are your options? I acknowledge issue for any of my happiness things. My lowest is, for, is housing happiness for 36. Alright, so, one? yeah, go ahead and do that one, and then you can build some apartments or whatever. Or the faction standing, or to praise one faction. But they're all in the 50s. So my lowest is housing. So should I do that one? Sure. Oh, housing happiness does not contribute to the approval of voters for the election. Okay, never mind. <laughs> All right, well, in that case, don't do that. Yeah. Wait, what? It says 
housing happiness does not contribute to the approval of voters for the election. And then underneath it says undecided voters most dissatisfied with housing happiness vote for El Presidente. So which is it? I don't know. I, I generally don't do that. Uh, maybe go back. Can you go back or can you not do that? Can you not yeah, go back? I can, I, I, it's a screen. It's a pop-up screen. I have to choose something. Mm. This is... It's very contradictory. Yeah. Housing happiness does not contribute to the approval of voters for the election. And then undecided voters most dissatisfied with housing happiness vote. <laughs> what? That means... That simply means... I guess that's currently undecider, undecided people right now vote for you. But I don't know. It's mm. all strictly above board, of course. Pick it. All right, all right, I just delivered a speech. <laughs> okay. Um, another option is um, let's see. Your standing with them is all in the 50s under politics? Yeah. For everyone. Okay. See, mine's at 60%, so I don't know how you have, like, 2% and I have 60%. It doesn't make any sense. Like I said, I think I think there's some sort of bug or issue with multiplayer. Could be. Because if you've been doing what I've been doing... Mm. I mean, you could try bribing again, but I don't know how much money you have left. I have to get this. Okay. Oh, coal. Ah, am I not mining coal? Dang it. What are you mining? I thought I was mining coal, but it was on. <sighs> okay. Mine thing. Do any of these offer? Ooh, my. Uh... Keep asking for crap that I don't have. <laughs> like what? Um, hold on. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! No! 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 How do I cancel a trade route? Uh, if you tr cancel a trade route, they'll be mad oh. at you. Shoot. What is it that you're trying to do? I did the green arrow for a trade route instead of a red arrow. Oh, so you're going to be importing stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a rough start. Didn't... <laughs> it's alright, well, it's alright, just leave it. 61% below standard. <laughs> wow. Oh... I mean, you can, I mean, maybe you can cancel I the trade feel, route. I feel like you. Mm -hmm. Go ahead and cancel. Your, what's your standing with the embassies? Oh, a 58, 55. Okay. No. I, no. It's up to you. I can bring these. Okay. They just keep asking. I was scrolling down, and they were asking for stuff that I don't have, and then I see something, and I'm like, ooh, I'll click it. <laughs> I have this. <laughs> for what? You mean the trade routes? Yeah, the trade routes. I need an allies trade route. Hopefully, coal finally to produce electricity to get my stupid canned goods so I can. I see you have a mine. 
<laughs> yeah, I have two mines. One for iron, one for coal. Although, how come this one's not? Working. This one's not working. What is ex personal experience? What is that? I do not know. I've never, I've never had to adjust the voting before. Oh, okay, Mr. Pro. I'm Mr. just saying, I, I've never had to adjust <laughs> the ballots. What? So wait, what do I want to do? Export or import? Get. You want to export. Import means import. bring into your island. Export means ship it off. Take it. One of my brokers wants me to import with a non-superpower. Nah. You can cancel it. He'll give you something else. The metaphorical kind, not the kind that accidentally reduces the size of the workforce. Ooh. What? 150 loyal Tropicans voted for you. Okay. Nine individuals voted for your rival. Really? Yeah. So that's good. Yep. So that means you won the election. I wonder if your numbers are just bugged. Yeah, I think that's support is. I bugged. wonder. <laughs> I wonder if you're stuck in like the colonial era or something. Like maybe part of the the information is. I don't know. That's good. That's good. All right. So at least we can keep playing. Yeah. My advice is just keep doing. Just keep doing those quests for those um, people. Uh, get Swiss money so that you can continue getting Swiss money. And, yeah. And spend that Swiss money on keeping your factions happy. If you keep doing that, you'll win every election that comes across. You know what I'm thinking, too? Maybe I don't have enough people. Like, what's your population? Because it says... 254. How do you see that? Upper left-hand corner. It's the, oh, okay. It's the middle figure. Yeah. Never mind. No, you should be fine. I don't have an immigration center. You don't either. Mm. What's your politics at? Your your with your foreign relations, your diplomacy. A allies sixty one, axes fifty. Okay, you want to increase those if you can. Yeah. Um. To do that, how many trade oh. routes do you have? Two? I have, um, three. Three. You're gonna want, like, I do a total of four. Okay. I do four trade routes. And okay. I have two for the allies and two for the axes. Um, yeah. That makes sense. I need to get my housing happiness. And I have to fulfill it within 2,000 days. Okay. Um, then, yeah, go ahead and start working on that then. How do I know which types of buildings to build? Like, which houses? I would just do a little bit of each. Um, like, do, do your apartments. How much money do you have? <laughs> 11,000. 11,000, that's it? Yeah, I'm losing money. Um, from what? Oh, no, no, I'm getting, I'm sort of getting. Oh, I got 20,000. Okay. <laughs> I, you're confusing. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm sorry. It's fluctuating big time. Always a pleasure doing business with you. What's your, what's your money right now? Right now it's at 18,000. All right, click on it and go to your, you should have your economy tab open. Yeah. Um, what's your revenue and what's your expenses? Four eighty three. My expenses last month were two thousand. Wait, wait, wait. Revenue is what? Five well five forty five now. What do you mean five hundred five hundred and forty five dollars? Yes. That's not right. The revenue last twelve months twenty six thousand. <laughs> uh, can you hold on? 
Revenue for the last 12 months is what? <laughs> for the last 12 months is 26000 Okay, and exp expenses? For the last 12 months is 26000 So it's about even. Yeah. Okay. Revenue was like a couple hundred more. You're gonna but, want. You're gonna want. And the treasure, in the treasury, on the right side, where the blue highlighted revenue says last month, it says five hundred. That's what I was referring to. Okay. Yeah, I would just do the last twelve months personally, but. Oh okay. Um. Okay, so. Yeah, I guess. You're gonna need more. What What's your top selling? Go to your trade right now. Do you, uh, and we'll see if we can export some things that would give you more money. So the middle button says goods and prices under your trade wheel. Mm -hmm. Um, right now, looks like weapons, boats, cigars. Do you have a cigar factory? No. Okay. Um, you have you have rum. Are you producing rum? No. Um. Okay. One of those two things would have been good, but you have limited money, don't you? Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, I'm producing canned goods now. <laughs> canned Yay. goods. Yay. All right, let's see. Canned goods are... I have to pick a labor policy. Okay, go ahead. I don't know what to do. Happy childhood? Default state, maybe? Default, yeah, just do the... De I would always do defaults until you get used to the game. All right. One broker. My stand, my support is at forty percent. That's better. I yeah, don't, I, don't I don't know how it shot up, but shot up. <laughs> Good. Well, that's what you. That's what you need. Do I still loot the coffee, corn, and gold, and rescue educated people? Um, whatever, whatever would earn you the most money. Um, mm. I would do. I wouldn't worry about educated anymore. I would just do strictly resources, gold mainly, uh -huh. so that you can export it for money. Because money seems to be a tight thing for you right now. So I would just mm -hmm. focus on money. So okay. ex 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 I would concentrate on looting the most expensive commodities. Okay. Hmm. All right, let's do. Should I get another trade license? Not with the amount of money you have. Okay. Because you're running out of money. So I would only, I would focus on anything that would, I would focus on keeping people happy and generating more structures that would make you more money. Mm-hmm. I wish there was a place that tells me how many... Um, well-off people I have and how many poor people I have. There might be. Oh, wait, there is. Yeah, okay. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. The task is done. You ask how much you are to be paid? A quest? So, how? Uh... 
Hmm. How many Teamster offices do you have? Um, I have two. How many do you have? I'm building my third one because they want it. Okay. Yeah, go for it. it there's nothing wrong with having a lot of them. Because okay. they're pretty... They're pretty useful. Yeah. Just be careful with what you're spending. Mm-hmm. Now oh, you just spent like 5,000 bucks on something. <laughs> I did. What did you spend money on? No, I don't want to tell you. You're going to yell at me. What'd you spend money on? <laughs> What'd you spend it on? I spent it on a trade room. No, you didn't. I did. On what? Uh, like to for a trade license. Oh, to, for um, a trade license? Why? Yeah, because I wanted more trade routes. I see. I'm sorry. It's don't fine. Yell at me. I'm gonna yell at you constantly now. No, don't yell at me. I'm just kidding. Let's see. I guess. Another 20 other trade license. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh-huh. You don't even have the money for that. I know. <laughs> that was so bad. I saw that was there. Do bunkhouses decrease your housing or something? Well, they don't provide as much, um, they don't provide as much... Quality? Yeah. <coughs> wow, bless you. Sorry. But if you have a lot of them, would they would that be able to bring the housing happiness up or no? Like what brings the housing happiness up? Better housing, apartments, the service every housing structure has a service quality. And apartments have a higher service quality, for example. But poor people need to be in bunkhouses. Correct. Right? Correct. So I would do a mix of bunkhouses and apartments. But again, you don't have a whole lot of money, so you need to be careful with what you're doing. Yeah, I'm trying to get the stupid housing number up. I have 24 homeless people. Maybe I should probably build more. So, okay, so housing happiness help, is also... It's all gone so the homelessness is affecting too, I imagine. Well, yeah. Um, homelessness, people don't like that. But once you build a bunkhouse or two and maybe a couple apartments, you'll be okay. Ugh! My support mm -hmm. is always fluctuating between like 10% and then 40%. <laughs> That's, that doesn't sound right. I don't like <laughs> the nasty number. Alright, where are these shacks? Maybe. Too 
Well, I'm getting there, I think. Yeah. I hope. You can build parks, too. You can, but that's just to raise the score. The housing happiness no, score? No, that's, that's like beauty score. Mm. I'll build an opera house. Why not? That's it. <laughs> That's fine. Actually, you can actually request money from me if necessary. Yeah. How much, How much money? do you have? Like a million? I have <laughs> 77,000 right now. Jeez. That's not a whole lot, all things considered. Hmm. I love. You what? No, it's just the same. Board. Yeah, I don't know what else to do to increase this. I have to fulfill it within 1,000 days. I have an average housing happiness of 49, and I have 33 out of 49. Okay, yeah, you need more apartments. Um, you're gonna need more apartments and the like. But you don't have any money, or what? Sort of do. I can't- I just don't have well-off people to do it. Every one of my people is poor. Yeah, there's not much you can do about that, then. You gotta do- Hmm, maybe I'll just build apartments and then increase the wages. Can I do that? So that way people can be uh, well. But you don't have any money, though. You can't be... I mean, you've got limited amount of money in your bank. I have whenever, to try. You, whenever you increase the budget, well, you're not going to lose the game if you fail on that. It says promises made, so I have to make this promise. Right, but if you fail it, you're just going to lose support. Oh. It's, oh. Not, it's, not an, it's not an end game scenario thing. Oh, I thought... Okay. So my advice is, you know, if you need money, I can get. I, I have over a hundred thousand now. That's so, if you ask you, under the diplomacy menu, you can ask for money, and then I would build like a um. To get more money, I would go with um. I'm gonna build the rum thing. The sugar. cigars. Cigars are selling for two thousand more at the moment. Yeah. How, how many um tobacco farms and how many sugar farms do you have? I have one of each. Okay, so it doesn't matter. I built more. So either, yeah, build either the cigar or rum. Right now, cigars are selling for 11000 <laughs> per stack, okay. and then rum is 9000 per stack. I have to unlock the blueprint for cigar. Yeah. Um, or a gold okay. mine. Uh, you can build a gold mine. It's 9000 Like, it's... Gold is fairly cheap. A gold mine is fairly cheap to build. It's fine. No, seriously, though, if you need money, just ask for it. I've got a ton. Okay. It you should be to, okay. Do you know how to do it? Um, I'll figure it out later. Alright, it's under the diplomacy menu. Third button on okay. the right.
what's your money at now? Two thousand. Two thousand dollars. <laughs> you better ask for some money. I'm just saying. I'm fine. Thirteen thousand. How many teamsters See? do you have? How many Three. teamsters? Okay, that's good. Yeah, because I mean, you can produce all the stuff you want, but if you don't have teamster offices to deliver that stuff to your docks, then you're not going to make any money that way. Uh, that's right. Ooh, fish. Yay, fish. Do cows give meat or no? Um, yeah, it should. Uh, let me click on my cattle farm. They give meat and hides. Hmm. Yeah. This cattle, though. I don't like this map. <laughs> it's you too jagged. You don't I wish like the it was like a flat, open world. Mm. Negative now? No, I, <laughs> okay. I have four thousand. <laughs> okay, good. I wish it was a button to switch overlays, oh. like a between an overlay or the regular mm. map. Okay, that would have been nicer. All right, so where is this boat factory? Shipyard. How do you re how do you level up a church edict? Level up? Um, you have to you have to accept the edict in the edicts menu. Like you have to activate the edict, and then over time it'll automatically gain levels. The more the more an edict is active, the more uh, level it gets. Does that make any sense? I guess. Activate an so, edict. Activate an yeah. edict, and then just let it run. It'll level up. Okay. Ooh. Just trying to figure out where to put this stupid rubber plantation. Can any of these be of interest to you? It's all strictly above. Board. What do you need rubber for? I don't know, just to have it. <laughs> I would again. Are you looking at your trades to see what? Because rubber right now is selling for. Oh dear, uh, one thousand three hundred and seventy-five per stack. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, 
cigars and rum are selling for 11,000 a stack and 9,000 a stack, respectively. And gold is 9,000. I would do a gold mine first to get some income. Gold up mine. You, up to you, but a gold mine is the cheapest way to go without having to build a factory or unlock blueprints. You okay. should have a gold mine on the other side of your island, like... I don't know what orient... Uh, you're building something. Oh, you're building a farm further out there. I um, can't build over there. It's border. Like, there's no border. No, it should be right here. Um, I know you can't there. see what I'm... Past your farm. Here. Past the rubber farm that you're building. Okay. B build a road up to it, and then build past it, and then on the oh, edge... Oh, I see. There should be a gold mine yeah. out that way. Yeah, I see. Because I have one. Yeah. That's, um, the gold mine should give you some decent money for a while. They need to take tips in plan from Planet Zoo on how to build things. I think so. <laughs> okay, I got it. Presidente, there is... <laughs> Row and... They come, the better they are, right? I see you got the gold mine going. Now mm -hmm. trying to get your road figured out. There you go. Trying. I'm trying to make it look nice. Uh huh. <laughs> Dang it! And it just won't let me. Road system. <laughs> You're still eating stuff left and right over there. <laughs> I'm trying to make it look you're, decent. You're, 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 you're. you're Paradise there is bankrupt, and you're worried about how a road looks. It's not. I have twelve thousand in my name. Oh, good. What? Good. Twelve thousand bucks will get you far. Yeah. Ta -da. Good job. Much better. Ooh, what's this tunnel? Oh, I didn't know we could build tunnels. That's new. Can we build trains in here? <gasps> what do you want trains for? Love Again, you're bankrupt. Everyone loves. <laughs> I'll build a zeppelin, man. <laughs> a zeppelin. Ooh, that's. Yay! Where are you going, dude? Put out the fire. What is he doing? Oh. Yeah, that'll do it. One fire extinguisher for an entire library. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> there is absolutely you lied zero to me. hope. What do you mean I lied to you? I, I don't see any gold. What are you talking about? You said there were gold. There was a gold trade route. I didn't say there was a trade route, but you don't need a trade route to export goods. The tr all the trade routes do is give you a bonus to what you're exporting. Uh, you can export anything in the game for money. You do not need a trade route for it. The trade routes just give you a bonus, plus 10%, 20%, whatever. It also uh, increases your standing with that particular faction. Uh, okay. Got it. I came to see mm -hmm. you as soon as I found these cool. were available, Presidente. What do you Don't be afraid to ask for money. I've got 125,000 now. I have 23,000. Ooh, Ooh, look at that. Uh. Uh.
Alright. Eat it. I'm so glad I made this Ugh. deal with you, Presidente. Homelessness is racking up there. Now, the people, like, going to their jobs yeah. from the house, is it better to, like, put a house, um... The, the way that works, people will build a shack near their workplace if there's no nearby housing. So if you see a bunch of shacks in one area, that means there's a lot of people working at those structures but don't have a house nearby to live in them. People prefer I... to live next to their workplaces. Basically. Yeah, I agree. This game is pretty fun. Boxel. Box older bug. Sure. Oh, shoot. I the do miss Trop. I wish they would remake Tropico 2 a little bit because that was quite fun. Different. I've never played Tropico 2. Tropico 2 is pirate themed. Yes, oh. there's, the, there's pirate raids here, which is nice, but in Tropico 2, you had an island of like slaves and uh, pirates. You had to keep the pirates happy by giving them gold, sending them out to get gold, raid, different things like that. And you had to cool. keep factions happy. And you had to keep your pirate base hidden. Otherwise, mm. the other powers would come and find you and attack you. <laughs> it was hard. I mean, if for uh, because Tropico 1 and 2 were created way back in the day, it's, it's not as very user-friendly as it is now. Mm. Build a prison. I've already got one prison. They want me to build another prison. I didn't even get that. We it's randomized. Quest. We'll get random quests. It's stupid. Yeah. I'm just gonna build it then demolish it. Ooh. Raiders have a chance of twenty percent to die on the mission. Is that like what bad? are you what are you trying to do? <laughs> I was just looking at the upgrade for the pirate code. Oh. Maybe that's a good thing if you're, like, overpopulated. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Yeah, no. I wouldn't do that. Really? Uh, mm -hmm. I need to get my appointment. Now, here's a question. If there's uneducated citizens working in a place that requires uneducated people, if you built a school, will those uneducated workers um, you'll have try to get educated? Yeah, but you'll never... I, I Very rarely do I... People that have a high school education will still work in un, uneducated buildings. Hmm. Okay. The heck, I built the prison. Oh, it's a dungeon. Oh, my bad. Demolish. <laughs> I built the wrong thing. Uh, I don't want to pay eighteen thousand dollars for that. No. Do any of these offers? You're swimming in money. Do it. <laughs> Fine. Keep the capitalists happy. I gotta build a prison. <laughs> I've got a dungeon, and then next door I've got a prison. <laughs> yeah, my standing, my my support is still 14, 14%. 14 okay. But my factions are all, like, in the 50s, except for my religious faction. They're oh. pretty low. It's weird. It's hard to keep all the factions happy, really. Yeah. I wish these buildings would tell you what exactly what factions they go for or they go to um if you go to 
sure I remember what screen it is. Oh. There's a way to see what modifiers. Yeah, there's a modifier sec. Standing modifiers. Commando Garrison, for example, the militarists love that. Uh, religious mm -hmm. people, they hate the Commando Garrison that I built, so I, I have a lower standing with them. So mm -hmm. it's it's always a it's always like a tug of war. Making one happy makes the other one unhappy. Well, it's rough. Yeah, well. Prison El Presidente is done. <laughs> Our money's at work, Prez. I optioned the stock, stocked up. Let's see your city. Oh, it's all bustling. Look at you expanding everywhere. What are you talking about? I see. My people are going to come work for you. Nah. <laughs> Oh, look at this bridge! What is that over there at the end? That island. There's nothing there yet, but I'm making way for this island over here. There's um, an outpost on it. I'm trying to claim it, but I don't know how to do it. So, oh. it's something that I'm just trying to figure out. Because I've never played multiplayer, and I've never seen that before. It's, mm. a, it's a neutral area, and I'm trying to claim it, but I can't seem to do it. I see. The one with the volcano? Yes. Purchase the outpost in it. It's another uh, election. Mm, it seems like you need military. I've got a barracks. Maybe I need something else. I will de deliver another amazing speech. Another amazing speech. Yeah, pick another... one that you know that you can do, I guess. <laughs> uh, we'll see. <laughs> blame allies. I'm going to blame it. <laughs> you can blame the allies. <laughs> Goods <laughs> money. That's awesome. I didn't know I could do that. I'm sure they're not going to like that very much. <laughs> Your allied support is going to tank if you do that. Yeah. Blame allies to gain voter approval while worsening relations with the superpower. <laughs> well, what's your, what's your standing with them? 72 and 79. Oh. I don't know if you want to risk it or not, but I'm just saying. If, if you want to try, you could, but I don't know. What's the negative? <laughs> Hold on, wait, wait. It says, I cannot make a promise since the people still remember that you broke the last one. <laughs> oh, I see. Well, there you go. Oh, boy. That's funny. If you scroll to my island, can you hear my speech? Uh, no. No, I can't. I can see what you're doing. I can see stuff. But every time I click on a building, it doesn't tell me what it is or anything like that. But I, I can see people driving around on your streets. Hmm. What? What's the highest um, relation for a standing can you get? 100. Oh, just a flat 100? Mm-hmm. For allies and axes? Yep. What's your approval rating? Presidente. For what? Well, it says election day uh, on the left. It says election day in blue. Oh, election day soon, election day in 16 months. Yeah, and then below that you should see a thumbs up, thumbs down, and thumbs sideways. Yeah. 11% thumbs up, 10% thumbs down, 78 thumbs sideways. All right, so you still, <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It'll be fine. <laughs> I'm making money, so that's not bad, right? right what, what, how much money you have? 64, 65. Oh, wow. You have a lot then. That's good. Mm-hmm.
Good job there, Presidente. Thanks awfully. Hey, I'll say this about war. It keeps us busy with exciting... Our comrades, rejoice it! Making stuff is good. It... What's a regime tool? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay. Mm. Oh. Oh no, another fire. Yeah, fires are gonna happen on a regular basis. Not much you can do nah. about it. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Nah. Um, if they're out of their, if they're, if the fire, if the, if the building on a fire is out of range of the fire station. It doesn't matter. It, a fire truck will still dispatch to try and get it. It should. Just be patient. It should, it just, it's just going to take a little bit sure for it to get mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. for you, Presidente. And if it's just a shack that's on fire, there's not much to really worry about. Hmm. It was a bunkhouse. It was a precious, precious bunkhouse. Mm. <laughs> Hi, Ishwa. How are you? Hey, Ishwa. Would any of these be a bit? You should. Is there a way to save it? Why? Just. Yeah, I'll save it. Before the election. <laughs> well, it's not gonna matter, I don't think. Oh, you have to do a military force and defeat that outpost in order to claim the island. How do you know that? That's what it says. Well, that's Which what one? It's... Which one are you looking at? The top right. Under description? If I just click on the, on the actual outpost, like the blank... The yeah. neutral outpost there. Yeah. And I go to the description. Engages enemy squads during military conflict. Ownership of this building constitutes control of the region. So you have to, like, attack it, I think. Okay. That's what I'm assuming. Yeah, I just don't know how to do it. Ooh. Did you win the election? It was a close one, they said. <laughs> But it did. You did. You did succeed. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's good. Hmm. You said you're trying to get the one in the top left. I was just trying to get any of them, and I can't seem to do it. Okay. See what happens. <laughs> 
What did what did what are you doing? I'm gonna build a barracks. I already have a, then... I, I have a barracks. I just Can uh... you send them over there? I'll try. Or like if you built a road to that outpost. I can't build a road in neutral territory. If you try to build a road in the neutral territory, it won't let me, as far as I know. Oh. Broker. <laughs> Say what now? The broker is kind of annoying. Like, I'm trying to build stuff, and he's like... Oh, I know. Stuff pops up all the time. I wish instead of things popping up, I wish it was like a notification bar. Yeah. But it's Tropico. <laughs> Tropico should be like Spanish pop-up. Right. That's what it should be called. Good deed, Presidente. Say so, the man's. Yeah, it doesn't say how to actually get the the outpost, which stinks. Yeah. Unless I need some kind of seaport or something. I'm looking up online, and there's a someone just says there are two ways to get it: by using Swiss money, setting work mode of military buildings too offensive. Mm. Um, I tried doing that with my barracks, but I didn't really get anything that would help me. I wonder if you need, like, a plane, an aircraft. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I've never- I've never done the whole territory thing in multiplayer before. Mm-hmm. Like, that's new. But in single player, it's easier? There is no- there is no territory in single player. Uh, that's what's confusing me. You know what I mean? Nice. I've never seen yeah. sections of the map broken up like that. Okay. Every time I try and build something, something pops up. Yeah. In my case, it's just the broker. <laughs> I had the nightmare again, Presidente. Everyone has friends, right, Prez? <laughs> wow. Do you not have a mute button? <laughs> Sorry. Jesus. Bad. Wow. Bless you. <laughs> Sorry. wonder would this work would what work hold on
right now it's grayed out. There's a little yeah. crown on, on the bottom right. It says claim, but I can't seem to. It doesn't tell me what I need to purchase it. I wonder if I can't do it within a certain era. Like maybe I can do it in the next era. I don't know. Hmm. Presidente, your aid is appreciated. With your help, we'll double our armed forces. Re yes. A few opportunities came up. Nothing illegal. Well, nothing that can be proven to break any laws. All these exclamation points. Oh, whoa. Well. What exclamation points are you referring to? On the very on, bottom? On, on the bottom. And I don't know where... Uh, thing. <laughs> uh, okay. Correct. <laughs> yeah. Sure. I, I'm, I'm, like, focusing on right now. got 130,000 in your treasury. Yeah. Now I do. Uh-huh. You made it seem like you were all worried about your money situation. You so what are, are you, what are you exporting guy, like, that you've got so much money now? I think that the gold really helps. So thank you for that. You think so? Mm-hmm. Another Teamster's office. <laughs> you have like the dungeon and they keep wanting me to build Teamsters. That's yeah, I, I have like four now because they want Teamsters too. So yeah, I get that. Crazy. One, two, three. Comrades are Produce corn. I could do that. I like those ones. Mm. I came to see you as soon as I found these were available, Presidente. What do you think? I'm totally customizing my palace right now. <laughs> Are you really? <laughs> yeah. Your town, this your is... your city could be burning down right now, for all you know. Please. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. I'm going to have it leading straight to the circus. All I hear is like brr -ra, brr -ra, brr -ra. <laughs> From what? I don't know. There's like alerts going everywhere. I'm not paying attention. <laughs> well, if you're loot, well, here's the thing though. If you're getting requests and you're missing them, yeah, your, your satisfaction's gonna tank. So I would do that in your off time. Yes, you're right. But this needs my attention. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh what? My. What happened? Nothing. 
Nothing at all. This is so cool. <laughs> well, here's the thing, Ishwa. We're playing co-op, so if she tanks, I tank. Oh, no! No, 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 no. We won't, we won't tank. Uh-huh. We'll be fine. Uh-huh. You watch, you'll see. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm done. Done. Oh, you're- Wait, no, you're... not. Oh, my God. <laughs> I didn't know we could do paths. Oh, look at this. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> I'm almost done, sorry. Oh my gosh, are you- which- oh my goodness. What happened? Mm. <laughs> How many requests have you missed because of this need so to many. Cause... What's the point of customizing a palace that's going to be burned to the ground anyway because your people are angry with you? <laughs> Just ask nah, I'm fine. asking for a friend. Do you like it? Do you like my palace? Do you see it? I'm not even going to look at it now. No, look at it! No! <laughs> look at that it! That is your punishment. I will not look at your palace oh, anymore because of your, of your overwhelming need to customize during a crisis. <laughs> No, it's not. You're, a you're accessorizing got... a palace that's gonna be burned down <laughs> soon. So just say. Nah, look at it. It's so beautiful. Not looking I at increased. It. I increased my standing um, to fifty-one percent. I think because they like the roof. Of <laughs> mm. If I could build the walls, I would, Ishwa. Unfortunately. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Ugh, excuse me. Oh, I thought you saw my castle for a second. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're like, ugh. <laughs> okay. How do you get, um, Swiss money without the broker? Um... Is there a way to do that? <laughs> your bank has a mode called slush funds, but you need to research it in your library first. Oh, cool. And that's the only way, you think? Mm. Right. Well, I know it okay. is. Oh. But that's, like, the only, only way? As far as I know. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. You can also earn Swiss money in certain quests. Mm. Where, you know, sometimes as a reward, you can choose Swiss money as your reward. Hmm. Oh man, you should see my castle. Are you still working on it? No, but you should see it though. It's beautiful. <laughs> oh my god, you have to see it. Critique it. You're a critic. Give me a minute, I'm putting a cabaret down. <laughs> so I can drown myself. In feathers. <laughs> In feathers and alcohol. <laughs> You're gonna need it when you see this. <laughs> <laughs> I could just picture it. Oh my god! <laughs> what the heck with the yeah. purple? What is what? this? What is- It's beautiful. That is such an eyesore. 
No, it's not. Is <laughs> that a good? Is that a money on the top with a safe? <laughs> yes. And a piggy bank? <laughs> that is. Wow. Wow. That's beautiful. Look at my flamingo pond. I did, not, I did not even see this. Hold on. Flamingo <laughs> pond. I see the flamingos. And my flags on my roads. Oh, I love it. So cool. It I'm... leads the way to the circus. Mm hmm. No, uh, mind a lot. Job quality is not new. Um, it was in the previous Tropicos as well. Job quality is affected by wages. Um, in previous Tropicos, like three and four, you could increase job quality by raising their wages. In five, you had to increase the budget of the buildings since they got rid of the individual wages. Hmm, maybe I should put another fire station. Fires. That's stupid. You jealous of my house? Huh? You jealous of my houses? Not at I'm all. A, I mean, of my castle. Not at all. <laughs> Barricade windows. Oh, it's locked. A lot of these are locked. A lot of what? Oh, for the next era? Um, a lot of the... Palace stuff? Yeah, the palace things are locked. Well, that's why I asked how, um, how do you get money? Uh, Swiss money instead of the broker? Because if you you can unlock the um the wacky inflatable arm flailing yeah, treatment. Yeah, I, I see that. <laughs> Our comrades, Words are hard. <laughs> Correct. The foundation of peace, Prez. International peace. I wanted that fish tank. Yeah, fish tank. It's really nice looking. So what? Hmm. All right, so we can get past this era if we do an alliance with... I'm going to try and do that with one of mine... One of my superpowers. Allies, I think. Request alliance. There we go. Need your help, Sabotage Is access four times. Have a commando garrison. Alright, so I have to just do that four there. times. Um. So that's annoying. How do you... St oh. How do you what? Uh, nothing. Making stuff is good. Do you ever do those heists from the 
from the pirate coves? I do, but here's the thing with the heists. They take a long time, and if you need to complete a quest like, um, complete a sabotage mission, mm -hmm. you can't do it while the heist is in progress. Mm. It just stinks. I don't like the timing. It takes too long. But I, I do like to do the, uh, the heists. You get some now, more. are they one-time things, or are yeah, they... Yeah, it's, it's a one-time thing. And you can only and you can only pick one, one like building per era, so you have a choice of like three buildings. You choose one, and that's the only one that you can capture for that era. And then you, when you move on to the next one, you can capture one of three new buildings or four, or whatever. Oh, so right now you can only do either the Stonehenge, Brandenburg Correct. Gate, Sophia, or um... you have to choose one. That stinks. Hmm. Kind of like... Alright, I have way too many fires. Fires? Yeah. From what? What's on fire? Uh, the shacks? Um, no. The fire station is on fire. <laughs> no, the no, fire house... station itself is on fire. <laughs> That's good. That's a good sign. <laughs> no, just houses. South. What do... What causes fire? Uh, I don't know. Just... Are you doing the era thing? Or do I have to- I, I, I guess I'll try it and see if I can advance to the next stage without you. I just want to oh, see- Oh, sorry. Well, no, I just want to see if it's possible. I... No, you have to ally yourself with one of the two superpowers. I would do the allies if you're good with them. What's your Request diplomacy? Request alliance? Yeah, what's yeah your... I can do that. Okay, what's your, what's your standing with the Axis powers? Uh, hold on. Um... Hold on. Allies demand. Finish sabotage for Axes. Have a commando garrison. Don't expel allies from the mm -hmm. Yeah, so you so need a, you need a commando... It. Yeah. You need a commando garrison. Yep. And then do that sabotage four times. I'm in the process of doing that now. The citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. It seems that they want a choice in how they are ruled. Hmm. Oh, I know what that is. Acknowledge. That means select your lowest... That, you know, you said you didn't know how that election worked? Mm hmm In reading this, people are looking at all these different problems. You're yeah. acknowledging that housing stinks. So now people that are angry with about the housing will no longer vote against you on that issue. So you're picking one of those bad things and acknowledging it. It's bad. People won't vote against you on it anymore. You know what I mean? Yes. Cool. How do you sabotage Axie? Um, on the pirate window. The pirate window? Mm hmm under Commando Garrison tab. It's the middle one. Crap. Oh, oh, oh. One, two. So I gotta do this four times? Yes, just queue it up four times. so annoying that um, I have an exclamation point where my constitution is, but yeah. I don't know why. 
It's fun. It's yeah. It's annoying. I've had that before too. Mm. Mm -hmm. I love the music. <laughs> okay. So if we're doing sabotage missions against the Axis, maybe we have to do trade routes to in order to bring them back up. I don't think it's gonna really gonna affect them all that much. I could be wrong mm -hmm. about that. I'm yeah. I've been doing Axis missions to help out with that, but I'm doing that anyway. Mm. You can also praise them as a one-time thing for five thousand, and you'll under the diplomacy menu, mm -hmm. and you'll get some like ten standing with them. See, it's up to you. How do you make boats? How do you make boats? Um, mm -hmm. you need a shipyard. Oh, I see. Okay. You need you need log a logging camp to make logs, and then a, a lumber mill for the planks, and then a shipyard to make ships. I've been doing that. Yes. Making stuff. Coconut harvest. <laughs> Just have coconut harvester. Yeah. Maybe that's pointless to do, like, in the later ages. Yeah, I mean... I don't know. Well, it depends. If you have a lot of unemployment, why not? But if you're... If you've... Yeah, it's, it's up... It's it's based on how many un, um, unemployed you have. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. relations is tanking. Well, yeah. Are you doing the sabotage thing? Yeah. Ugh. Oh, did I just cancel it? It's a pain in the butt. Except. Now, here's a question. Should I have... Two, um, buildings, um, two, like, lower tier buildings per one higher tier building. Like, if well, I'm, if I have, I'm producing rum. Yes, I have two tobacco farms for cigar factory and two sugar plantations for the, sh uh, sure. two sugar for the rum. The yeah. Okay. You, now, do these prices, are, are they in fluctuation? Yes. But, like... Due to, it's like, due, due. It's due to the expansion, the llama expansion. Prices are fluctuating. Rum right now stinks. Rum just went down. But dude, is that because we're like I'm? I think it's. I, it, I think it's random. If, I was gonna say like, is there supply and demand? Like, Not. I don't know. In order for what we do. No, I just think prices fluctuate. I don't think there's a supply and demand. I could be wrong, but um. Yeah, I don't... yeah, I'm definitely running out of space here. <laughs> Dang it. Ooh. Should I spend 10,000 gold or deliver 280 gold Should to you... the pirate? What'd you say? I have to I have to bribe the burgermeister. Should I spend like my my money or should I spend like gold resource? It's up to you, whatever one you prefer. Yeah, just there's the no, there's no hard or. F it depends on what you need right now. Um. All right, I won the election barely. Barely. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he he keeps saying that's a close one. <laughs> Yarg, that's a close one, Yarg. You know. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's what he says.
almost there. Fulfill trade route with the allies. Okay. Yeah, I'll just. <sighs> What's wrong? No, nah, they just. The, the exports stink. Like, there's nothing that I want. I'll just import some cocoa. That's fine. I've got money. Like, the trade routes for the US or the Allies stink right now, so, like, they don't want anything that I have. Oh, for the Allies? Yeah. I'm having the opposite. <laughs> oh, yeah? Mm hmm. The Axes are, like, killing me. Let's import something cheap. Um, guess what? We'll you can do like a volume too. Like you can have it deliver more for a better standing rate and yeah, for more money. Yeah, but it and when it comes to the trade routes, it only cares about completing one trade route. So putting it on the volume highest volume, it's going to take longer to do. You yeah. Know what I mean? So it's just better to. Good job there, Presidente. Thanks awfully. Hey, I say this about hey. war. All done. Does this game have snow? Um, I don't think so. No, I've not seen snow in Tropico Six, unfortunately. We're in the Caribbean, <laughs> so yeah. I doubt the Caribbean gets much snow. I have a cousin who's never seen snow in her life. Mm, really? Mm hmm Like, she doesn't know what it feels like, what it looks like. You can mail some to her. <laughs> Put it in an envelope, it just, it just shows up as water. Because it's been sitting for... We'd have to freeze it in a special container. <laughs> I remember um, one of my other cousins, Puerto Rico, uh, he came to visit me when he was, like, 15 years old. Mm-hmm. And he saw snow. He saw snow for the first time. He was like really excited. <laughs> really, it was so cute. Excellent, excellent. You've got three feet of snow. Wow. That's we haven't. Cool. Luckily, we haven't seen too much snow here on the um, eastern side of the United States. It's cold on certain occasions, but it's not too too bad. Ooh. My communism is going up. <laughs> is that good but or my bad? Capitalist, my capitalist is going down. <laughs> okay. Comrade. That's funny. That's so funny. It's funny because communists and military are like really good in the 60s. But then religious and capitalists are like pretty low, I think, in mm, the 40s. Sure. So wait, how did you... Where did you see the buildings, like, where the factions liked the buildings, like, certain buildings? Where was that at? Um, uh, under the support section. Uh, upper left, that little percentage. Yeah. Under politics, and then on the bottom right, it says standing modifiers. Uh, you can see But things. it doesn't have, like, any specific building um like check your military it might say apartment plus two or it, it'll say military check click your factions click your individual factions on yeah. the politics screen on the bottom right it might say yeah 
It says building modifiers, but it doesn't say like what exactly which buildings give it. Yeah, then there's no drop down. Yeah. If there's a number, you can do a drop down. Oh, uh, but if there's no number. Right. That stinks. <laughs> yeah. Because I want a building that'll modify some on me. Oh, okay. Yeah, I imagine you get more snow than I would. Now, I don't want to alarm you, but I'm... How do you increase a fertil um... Fertility? No, the, um... Population? No. Uh, well, the f fertility, because fertility for a plantation decreases over... Oh, I thought you meant, like, population fertility. Um, you no. mean... Look for the plantation. Fertilization? Is that what you're calling? Yeah. Um, I don't know if you can. I could be wrong. Yeah, fertility... I think only through upgrades can you do it. Hmm. But I could be wrong. Okay. I wouldn't worry about it too much. I mean, I'll look it up while I'm waiting, but... It's fine. Uh, do upgrades increase the the plantation upkeep? Or only if it's specified? Sorry, I'm trying to... Re what, what did you say? Oh, I'm sorry, never mind. What did you say? I asked if... Upgrading a building increases the upkeep of that building, or, or only um, if it's specified? Only if it's I would imagine it's only if it's specified. Mm. Yeah, there's not a whole lot of help on this. I'm trying to- I'm trying to figure out how to capture this outpost over here, but... Like, mm. nothing's popping up for me. I think I might have to wait for the next era just to see if it shows up then. Guess I'm not producing any milk. Oh, I am. Okay, meat. Don't you just... Oh. Okay, I have allies now. Um, you have four allied trade brews to do? Oh, yeah. So, so you did or didn't? I. Yeah, it says allies trade brew four. Okay. Okay. Well, they're, in, they're underway. It takes into account what you already have, right? Um, should. Yeah, it should. Mm hmm. Oh, interesting. What? Um... I'm just reading stuff. I see. <laughs> Pompous bells for the church is one of the required upgrades. Pompous it's bells? Pompous bells. <laughs> what? I don't get it. What's what's pompous bells for your religious up for? Uh, is it chapel upgrade or the church upgrade? The church upgrade. I kind of want to do it. <laughs> well, what does it do? It decreases the visiting. 
so they spend less time in it. Oh, leg room. I just have leg room and shared seats. Oh, pompous bells. I see. Decreases mm -hmm. the visit. <laughs> so basically, you're annoying people with the bells that they they spend less That's time. That's hilarious. I'm gonna use that. That's funny. Oh yeah, my church is yeah. I'm gonna go into yeah. <laughs> I only have one church. Oh, can you can you slow down the time real quick? Yeah. Go ahead. Oof, I have 90 days to. To do what? Uh, hold on. To build a cathedral, uh, a thing of. Was cabaret. It was it just to accept the request or? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. It should. Yeah, you should have. There shouldn't be a time <laughs> element except. O only if um. A lot of those requests are not timed. It's just it's just time to accept the quest. And if it times out, you lose your reputation. Okay. Phew. Gary. Shoot. Too many poor people in my house. Or in my... <laughs> my place. Now, do the bunk houses, do they have to be next to roads, or can they be, like, behind a house? They can be, yeah, there's no road requirement for them. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. You can put the bunk, I put the bunk houses, um, you know, behind buildings. Wherever, wherever there's shacks is where I put them, generally. I always thought they needed... Mm -mm. Roads. Oh, well then, heck yeah, I'm gonna have to, like, fill this whole slot up. That's what I do. I just, I put bunk houses and apartments and houses i fill spaces with them cool all right one more allied trade route right, i'll just import i will import bananas there we go, done. All done. One. Do you remember those wonderful white billowing sails? I don't suppose you've seen them anywhere. Deliver cloth. Where do I get cloth from? Wool sheep, maybe? Maybe. I think I have to produce cloth from a factory. Uh, creamery, cannery, toy workshop, to no, no. textile mill, I think. Yeah. Is it ex export for a lot? Cloth sells for. Nah, it's not even worth it. Yeah. <laughs> I'll build it, complete this, and then demolish it. So wait, is it? Hold on. What do you think? What was your question? <laughs> oh, sorry. Hold on. Um, I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> That's very helpful, thank you. <laughs> More fun. Rocket, the newest threat raining death from the sky. The palace assures all its citizens that no country thinks tropical worth sending rockets against. Um, so plate buildings that don't have a road requirement can literally be put anywhere? Correct. Wow. I don't know. Does that work for all the other tropicals? Yes.
Dang it. I feel like building my city now. <laughs> Sports Prez, who do Good Lord President, mm. the wars are over, Presidente. I would kiss you if it was not. I just advanced to the Cold War, but I don't know if you got that same. Uh, two skins. No, because I still need four allies trade routes. Okay. Hey, I say this about war. It keeps us busy with exciting it. Do Excellent, excellent. I'm okay, so now I've got how many factions this time? Eastern block, western block. Hi Trifler, how are you? Three hours ago? Yeah, I can't believe it's been three hours already. Are you serious? Oh my gosh, what time is it is seven forty one PM. Oh no. Whatever, we're not doing anything important. I'm not. <laughs> I don't know about you. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Game is so addicting. It can be. Canned goods, cigars. And then for that, we'll do. Man. They What's wrong? No, they just don't want anything I'm producing. I guess jewelry and. See, that's why I want to do, like, one of everything. The the prices make it difficult. Uh, the fluctuating prices makes it difficult. I'll just mm -hmm. import stuff from them. I can't. I can import uranium. What I do with it, I'm not exactly sure. I would be very expensive. Mm hmm I'll just have to wait. All right. Um, let's see. Jewelry. Nope. The claim outpost is still grayed out. So there's something... I don't know how to claim this stupid outpost. <laughs> yeah, I've been trying to figure it out myself. Idea. President.
were ready to hold the... Now that the war is over, Presidente, we finally have a chance to demonstrate... Making stuff is good, isn't it? Yes, the gr oh, that's weird. My quests aren't showing up on the left anymore. I wonder if that was what was going on with you. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Pain in the butt. All right, tourists. You still there? Mm-hmm. Okay, just checking. Sorry, I'm like... No, just want to make sure that you're still, still alive and kicking over there. You're really concentrating. Oh, yeah. I totally am. <laughs> Ah, oh, fudge nuggets! What'd you do? Uh. Ray, another fire! Yay! I, it's funny because, like, all these houses are packed in now. Like behind one another, and I wonder how the heck fire people, the fire brigade, brigade, mm. um, crap. What? Delay heist by thirty six months. Deliver weapons to commando garrison. What? Um, it's. Damn. Are you trying to do something? I don't know. Are you trying to heist something? Oh yeah. Okay. That will come up okay. on a regular basis. Guess fish. Gosh. At least. Yeah, my state. My place is becoming a military <laughs> order. <laughs> <laughs> order state. <laughs> oh, man. This is why. Nope. Don't forget to to do your election speech. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I can't do housing happiness anymore. That's oh, weird. Can't. Should be able to. Well, let me. Ooh. I can promise. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't promise anything if if it's gonna give you like you can I, praise a faction. I promise nothing. I promise nothing. <laughs> there you go. That's the spirit. I have an Axis ultimate. The superpower will abandon their embassy on Tropical. You will need to reinvite them before you can resume diplomatic activity. Why would you kick oh, them out? Because they want to break relations with me, I think. Um, can you praise them real quick? Or... Uh, let me try. Who was that? The Axis? Ooh, or the Axis? yeah, because because my relations with them is at Fort. Well, that Bad. would do it. Um, praise them and do more. Um, try and do some quick. I trade can't. Notes. It's 41, 41 to praise them. 
Oh, well then do those trade routes then. Or do you have any Swiss money you can give them to... I just have to complete a sabotage oh. allies raid. I'll, I'll do that, that's fine. Because I'm pretty high up with them. Well, sabotage allies. Okay. <laughs> That's crazy. All right, some more trade routes with them, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I would I would try and get that up as quickly as possible, so you don't. They want nothing from me though. Like, ugh, everything's bad. Be vigilant, and report all strange activities, especially from family really? members. What are these other flags? Just like. Say what now? What are the flags in the trade routes? Like Those are neutral parties that have no bearing on... I mean, it, but if you accept trade routes from them, that will lower the standing of the other factions, so don't do that. If you're okay. hurting... Yeah. We can't bank on saving the planet if people don't have any interest in being green. <sighs> Garage and bus stops. <laughs> Fine. I got people attacking. Wait, people attacking you? Yeah, gor gorillas. I bet you it's from the other. You gonna lose? You're a friend of the Earth. I got like three bear. <laughs> Military education. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I've got a problem, Presidente. Yeah, with those sneaky red. Are you winning the fight or no? I don't know. Okay. Um, they just disappeared. It says rebel threat decreased to none. Oh, okay. So I don't know what the heck happened there. Hmm. I don't know if I'm gonna make this. What? Hold on, sorry. Hmm. I have 600 days to sabotage the allies, but I'm only at 50% doing my heist. Ah, oh, because I was doing a heist. That's that's what I said. Oh, so wait, you're going with the al the Axis powers? I have to sabotage allies in order to, in in order for my Axis to not break their pact with me to leave the embassy. Okay. Can you cancel so your just, heist? I could. What, up, is up. that what? Would that do anything? No. You just have to redo it again in the future. Uh, okay. <laughs> I paid like 15,000 bucks for nothing. Well, then, then don't. You're just going to spend more time in that era, and I don't know, you know. That's fine. Totally. totally That's fine. why I said not to do any totally heists, fine. like when you're trying <laughs> to do a timed thing. Yeah. Alright, whatever. Alright. So now, what am I doing? I'm sure the good citizens of Tropical.
You should save it. <laughs> Why? I get nervous. I'll save it, but... <laughs> well, we're one-fourth of the way to the goal. Nice. Just, just saying. We've done it. The rocks rolled off the deck and onto the dock. Ah! Did you die? Look, no, look at your look at your town. It looks low. You have a lot of space. I have like no space. You have so much space. I compact everything. I do too. You look like you're spread though. On certain well, it's just that thing you're building next to your mine. Lovely. I have to wonder. Hmm. What? Are you building a fort? Do you have a fort? A fort? Mm -hmm. Um. I have. I don't think I have a fort, no. I'm gonna build a fort. I just wanna see if I can get that outpost to the fort. If you build multiple pirate coves, okay. Um, will will it completely? You can only build faster? one. It's a unique building. Uh, oh, I see. Okay. See, I'd love to get to this island somehow. Oh. Did I do it? I claimed it. How? I don't know. Um, maybe you have to be in a different era? Maybe that wasn't for me? Oh, I can claim this one. Which one? The volcano? The, the one, yeah, the one in the bottom right. Okay. I don't know why I couldn't do it earlier. That's weird. Okay. <laughs> it's weird. I, I don't know why, like, it was, it, there was no cost or anything, it just, yeah, I don't know. I wish there was more information. Yeah. The comrades are restless. Hooray. Build a tenement.
my axis is going up very slowly. Good. If you can get very them, slowly. if you can praise them with your extra money, I'd do it. Yeah, I have to reach a, rela a relation of 41 in order to do that. And I'm at like 22. Okay. Rough. I'll just trade cotton with them, it's fine. Even if it's not like profitable. Doesn't... Yeah, anything you can do to increase your score. Because these timed missions from them stink. Com yeah. <laughs> Comrade, secure this. Like, these menus are really handy, like the almanac and the overlays and the overview. Yeah. I just wish that they were actually labeled instead of hovered. Yeah. Labeled. Excellent, excellent. It takes some time to get used to how this is all done. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. No. No. My favorite song is on. Which one's that? Es que me gusta la rosa. <laughs> Something yeah. like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, I don't want to alarm you. But I'm going to need a rather prompt decision on these offers. What? What's wrong? I made an atheist state because the communists wanted it. Okay. And my religion, my religious faction went up. <laughs> like, well, yeah, what? because you're you're eliminating the religious need, so you you just got rid of all of the religious people. Kind of interesting, and I just got uh, um, a quest to build a church. <laughs> what? Okay, <laughs> that's so weird. <laughs> There's no need for it, but they want me to build a church. Okay, hey, whatever works for you know. Okay, that's. I'll do that. I like churches, anyways. The Church of Atheism. There you go. Ugh. <laughs> I believe that's called Scientology. Yeah, really. <laughs> the Church of Scientology. Illuminati. <laughs> sure. So, so wait a second. Can I build any building, like, let's say, on the island, and they'll go to it? Say what now? Because there's no... You said that that any building that doesn't have that doesn't have a road requirement, they yeah. can still get to. Yes. So if I just built it in that volcano, built what? <laughs> the church. Like, any building that doesn't <laughs> have a road requirement. You want to build it in the volcano? I'm just saying, like any building in general. You couldn't build it Why? in the volcano. Not in the volcano, but on that island. Yeah, they'll get to it. Um. It, they'll have to walk all the way back unless there's a garage or something. Oh, but they'll still get to it. Oh. Interesting. I didn't know. I, I all this time. I, when I'm you say in the volcano, I'm like, so you're just gonna drop this church into the into the hot volcano? Um, you're condemning people even before they got to the church. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can put a building over there that doesn't have a road connection, but. When they get there, they're going to walk home, I think. If it's anything like the older Tropicos. So okay. you may want to build like a garage over there so people can drive back and forth. That's how it was done in Tropico 3 and 4. You had to put garages all over the place so people could drive. I see. Oh, I thought it was just to reduce traffic or like city skyline. No. Garages help people get around. Interesting. Do we have garages in here? 
Uh, yes, first tab. But I, I don't know if you have it yet, because I'm on the third arrow, you're not. Mm -hmm. I'll build a bank, why not? The bank is good. It generates interest based off of what's in your bank account. Mm -hmm. So you'll get some decent money from it. Like, I earned... Oh. Hold on, about two hundred thousand dollars in interest so far. Oh, I bet you have like five of them, so you can get this game over. It's it's, <laughs> it's uh, diminishing returns, so you can't do that. Uh, let's see. All right, so it looks like cars are the new thing. Um, gotta mm -hmm. figure out how to make those. All right, so cars are steel and rubber. All right, well. Sure. I built the Brandenburg Gate. <laughs> Did you? Yeah, no more diehard uh, people. Like, no more diehard villages, diehard militarists, diehard communists, or diehard capitalists. Okay. Cool. And my support just shot up to 73%. Hey, serious? Oh, there you go. You've got a lot of diehard people on your island. That's the problem. <laughs> I know. Sir, yes, sir. The operation... Uh, there's so many strong people. How do you get rid of these strong people? Like, these strong... Strong what? Communists. Strong oh, I don't know. It's one part of the game I never really paid attention to. I mean, that's it's something introduced in Tropico 5 and 6 I really didn't care for. Uh, but... I'm just going to institutionalize institutionalize them yeah, in the fine. mental hospital. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, <laughs> just lock them away. It's fine. That's that's what you would typically do anyway, right? Arrange an incident. <laughs> yeah. An accident. There you go. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alright, uh, coal and iron, which I think I both... So wait a second. Are there people, like, Underneath people, like if you kill somebody, near like a leader. Oh, yeah. Wait. Affecting a, if you arrest a leader, it will trickle down to everyone else that they they'll hate you for it. Did you not understand, or no? I you're understand. silent. You're, okay, <laughs> I was um, sure. Sorry, I'm reading. I have to wonder if they keep. Up oh, scared me. Um, <laughs> so if they keep like having children, within the children are gonna have like stronger and stronger beliefs. I I don't know. Does I, that work? I, I don't I don't know how people work in this game. I just ignore it and do my <laughs> thing. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. I feel like I have an overpopulation. No, I don't, though. No homeless citizens. That's bad. Yeah, I mean, I wish I knew how to capture that, how to capture these outposts. It's weird. Yeah. Like, it doesn't say what is required to do it. I have to wonder if it's, no, I like, time-based. You know, or like maybe if you get to a certain point in your island where where it's like fifty percent covered, then you can claim it or something. Yeah, I don't know. It's just weird. Maybe because I built the fort and all of a sudden it's unlocked. <laughs> no, I built a fort too. Uh -oh. Um, I have a barracks, an army base, a fort. I have like one of everything. So I don't, I don't know what what caused this to work. Like, it's not working for me right now. It just says, purchase the outpost in its region. But it's not telling me what the price is or why I can't do it. I just think there's something off. I just, I don't know why. Not every nation is Tropico's friend, Prez. Not like I'm your friend. How's your relations now? 
Um, really bad. All right. Well, can you increase it any, any which way? Can you use Swiss I, money? I I can't. I don't think so. How do I use Swiss money on it? If there's um, an offer from your broker to increase. Oh, that's Sir, yes, sir. The upper... Oh, yeah. Sure. 10x is standing. Yeah. Sure. You want to keep that up before they get you. And how are you on the whole alliance thing with the allies? I'm at 94 with them. All right. Are you, can you initiate the alliance again? You should what be able mean? to. I still need to do four allies trade routes with them. Oh, okay. My if, trade routes. If you have to do import trade or do the imports, they're faster. Yeah. That way you can just bing, 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 knock them out, and then move on to the next era, so you don't have to deal with the axis anymore. Exports, Prince. Okay. Who doesn't love exports? Just, just as a suggestion. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, I read that too, Trifler. Um, but unfortunately, like, it doesn't say what buttons to press to do it. Um, for example, purchase the outpost in its region. Well, fine. I can't click on anything to do it. <laughs> like, it doesn't, it doesn't tell me how. And as far as the military goes, I was looking up on another thread. Setting your military buildings to offense mode... But then from ha from there, what do I do? You know what I mean? Like, I've got my barracks on offensive mode. I've got these other buildings on offensive mode. But it doesn't say how to bring your troops over here to, to handle those buildings. So that's what I mean. Like, there's something screwy with this. I just don't know. And I can't build a road over here to bring military over here in the first place. So I don't know what the deal is. But you're able to build on that island, right? Say what now? Yeah. You're still able you're built you're able to build on that island. Yeah, I'm I'm talking the about the left. other island. Yeah, I can build on that one now. I don't know how I got it. Yeah. Yeah, I can't get either of these islands, so maybe one is des designated to us. Maybe. Maybe I have to go for the opposite one. Let me, let me try it. They're both grayed out for me. I've got the Taj Mahal. Where the heck am I going to put this? On the island with the volcano. <laughs> put it by the tourists. Yeah, if I don't have enough Swiss money, I wish it would tell me how much I would need. Do any of these up? Would any of these be of interest to you? It's all strictly oh. a board, of course. <sighs> Alright, 17 vacant jobs. I better slow that down for a little bit. Let me try this other island over here. 
No, can't can't build there either. That's grayed out. Why is there an iguana on the one island? What? What? Um, if you zoom all the way out and look on those side islands that we haven't gotten to yet. Hold on. All right, what? Where? Look to the island next to you that you can't claim. Okay. Zoom out. Like, do a top-down view. Oh, that's cute. See the iguana? <laughs> yeah. Because the, the map is called um, Nest of Iguanas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's cute, though. There's your ugly purple palace. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's ugh. beautiful. Ugh. What? It's not ugh. You're ugh. Ugh. Did you do yours? A little bit. I didn't really customize it all that much. Uh, everything I wanted, I didn't unlock yet. I could, you know, there were some things I couldn't unlock yet. Yeah. I'm losing, like, where all my crap is now. Like, I don't remember where I put my grocery, my stuff. I don't want to put, like, two of the same buildings next to each other. I want a koi pond. <laughs> Reach a population of 1,000. Oh, that should be easy, right? How do I hire a college-educated... Um, hire one? Go mm -hmm. to a building that needs one, and then on the... where the workers are, there's an empty silhouette of a head. Click on it, and it'll give you the option to... Oh, uh, cool. <laughs> oh, oh, the customs office would have been a good one. Customs office for what? Yeah, to increase export prices. Yeah, I've had I've had that for a while. What the heck? I want one. So get one. Getting one. I forget where I put mine. Does it say anything if I click the eye? Uh, yeah, I've read it multiple times. Um, it just says, Engages enemy squads during military conflicts. Ownership of this building constitutes control of the region. The demands of defending a territory require the construction of an isolated fortification where never soldiers, blah, blah, blah. It doesn't say anything about what it needs. Like, I, I check that. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> Any of these offers look good? Oh. oh, I don't know. Yeah, in, in days of yore, I would actually increase immigration because I would always not have enough. But um, I just try and adjust my strategy accordingly. If I need one, I need one. I'll put it down, but I try not to use it. But it is useful.
Three unemployed, eight vacant jobs. Um, all right, we'll do. Let's get educated. And then gold, I still think is useful. Importing uranium. Yeah, I'm going to actually do that. Uranium sells for a lot, I think. Yeah, uranium mm -hmm. sells by itself 12516 It's really expensive. So if I can import it, then export it. Import it meaning rate it. Mm -hmm. And weapons. I wonder what weapons needs. I think weapons, though, antagonizes the foreign powers. At least they did in previous... Tropico games. Mm. Alright, it's back up now. Thank goodness. Good. I don't think I have nickel, though. Uh, okay, nickel is on an island that I cannot reach yet. That's nice. How come the knowledge says no income? Um, because no one's working there right now. People actually have to physically be at the building in order for it to work. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. These trade routes suck. Alright, um, I guess I'll just... <laughs> I'll import some hides really cheap to make them happy. It's fine. I haven't even researched everything in the World Wars yet. <laughs> the citizens are demanding elections, Presidente. Here comes the elections. It... The it's back down to 17%. I don't understand this whole... I think it's bugged, honestly, for multiplayer. I really do. I hate that there's certain speeches I can't give. I wish it would just... Why Why can't it give it? I don't know, it's like grayed out. Mm. Like, I want to click on deliver speech for a bunch of things that I can't. I have no idea if the deliver speech has a reuse timer. Um, I don't. I don't really use the speech that often. I'm just trying mm -hmm. it out to try it out, honestly. Import is taking it in, right? Yeah, you import means you're buying it. Yes.
<laughs> I didn't think about that. <laughs> what? It triflers laughing. I have my coal mine next to the Taj Mahal and the cathedral. And it's it, just the fact that there's going to be like black smoke all over the place. Just like all these buildings. <laughs> the buildings are like white inherently, but they're not going to be white anymore. I, I go efficient. I go for efficiency, not for aesthetics. But that's just me. <laughs> nickel is from a mine, right? Uh, yeah, but the nickel mine is on an island that I cannot access right now. What, what do you need nickel for? To produce weapons. Oh, I wouldn't produce weapons. Man, for a quest, I need it for a quest. What's the quest? I have to produce weapons for military standings. If I don't, their faction is decreased. Mm. Accept it and then just sit on it for a while. Yeah. Just to get you past the election. Again, just try and get those uh, trade routes done so that you can get... Um, like import, yeah. or you can import nickel maybe from somewhere. This is produced. Oh yeah, actually maybe. But yeah, accept the quest and maybe import the nickel. Mm hmm. But. Are you winning your election? I think so. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. That's always a great sign. <laughs> Just that part. Oh, do you have a trade institute? No. Is that? Do you like yours? Do you have? One? I don't know. Yeah. Allows you to manually provoke the market. <laughs> I think that's one of the new buildings as part of the Llama DLC. Mm. Oh, I get it. Looks interesting. The election is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical. <gasps> Yay! Cold War. Oh, you got it? Nice. Yeah. Did you win your election? Yeah. Cool. I think. I got a thumbs up of 12%. <laughs> I think. Oh, wait, no! <gasps> election day soon. Thumbs up 12. Thumbs down 25. Ooh. Scary. <laughs> Crap. Can you do anything? Like, is there any. Do you have any Swiss money? Mm, hold on. If I do... Yeah. Oh! Shoot, I lost it. Does that mean we lost? So. Oh, oh I'm sorry! Ponies? Okay, I guess I can keep playing. Yeah, go for it, go for it. I'll watch it. I'll see what I did wrong. Uh-huh. I wonder if you could take over my city. My support just went from 70% to 40%. Wow. Af after you left the game? I don't get it. So my people probably moved into yours and they were like, eh, yeah. yeah <laughs> like, <that's... old> <laughs> What's up with that? Like, I don't know. Like, I think multiplayer was screwy somehow. Yeah. 
I had seven. I had seventy to eighty percent, and all of a sudden I don't. But at least you got three hours out of it. I, I just. I still think multiplayer is a bit like screwy, screwed up somehow. It's weird. I, I'm sure they. I think it's. I don't know. I think it's well, there's like there's... right. We just can't read the numbers right. No, they don't no, explain. no. Because I had seventy to eighty percent support, and now I have forty-seven. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what's causing that large of a... Like, something happened there. Something caused a huge jump. I just don't know what. Yeah. Trifler wants to know what your lowest happiness rating was. But here's the thing, Trifler. Happiness in this game doesn't have as much bearing. Like, the, the in previous Tropico games, happiness was tied to your political standing. But in Tropico 5 and 6... Poli uh, your support is determined by your political, like, capitalist, religious, communist, military, industry, and, and it's determined by that. So it's like, ever since they entered, I don't like that personally. I think it should be based on happiness. But they've added this whole new politics thing, and I think that was bugged in some way in this multiplayer game. Because there's no way that my get my support should have gone from 70 to 80% to 45%. It just doesn't make any sense to me. Hmm. It says, what's your average Caribbean happiness versus regular happiness? Um, I'd have to look. I don't know. <laughs> um... Overview... Happiness versus average Caribbean happiness. What? <laughs> I, I, it's, oh, here, by it's here somewhere. I just have to find it. Uh, by the way, uh, Trifle and um, the answer to Trifle's question, my lowest happiness was uh, Faith at 39, but everything else was like in the 50s, 40s, and 50s. Mm. And my factions were in the 50s. I know there's a way to see Caribbean happiness, I just don't know where to find it. All these menus. People. I mean, I'm sure it does in some ways. I'm sure that happiness does play a part, but... Yeah, I know there's a way to find it, I just don't know where. As far <laughs> as playing Rusted Warfare again, um, if you feel free to donate, I will. If not, then I'm really not inclined to. Uh, it's probably... I could have sworn... I could have sworn it was here somewhere. I wonder if, like, I wonder if it was taking our happinesses into account. Like, maybe mine was good and because I was setting a, an average and causing yours to tank. So the better I did, the worse. I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't make any sense. I'm not. Yeah, I don't know where to find Caribbean happiness. I know it's here somewhere. I just don't remember where. Okay. I'm going to put this on 4X now. Sorry, no, you're only keeping it slow because of me. No. <laughs> oh, I was dragging you down. No, you're fine. <laughs> I was just trying to give you a chance to do your thing. Oh, that's so sweet. Well, you, you haven't played the game before, so it just makes sense. It says Caribbean happiness... You're supposed to have it up, and in order to do that, you have to intimidate your neighbors. <laughs> what? Okay. That I... Sure. I don't know. What the heck? Your average happiness needs to be higher than Caribbean. Sure.
I may have to start raiding people. Yeah, I think, I think somehow my gameplay was affecting yours. Like, my influence was somehow affecting yours. Like, rather be on the same, like, we were on the same team. Mm -hmm. But because my happiness or my, my satisfaction or whatever was up to like 70, 80%. I think I was setting some kind of curve. Mm -hmm. And in doing so, that caused yours to tank. So the better I did, the worse you got. I'm mm -hmm. guessing. I don't know for sure. It's. I, I don't know about this whole Caribbean happiness. It says that if you allow the rest of the Caribbean to be happier than your people, they will not approve. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, I just don't remember where that is. It should be somewhere, um... Is it in the commando, that commando raid building? No, it should be in the Almanac. There, in, in previous Tropico games, Caribbean happiness was in the Almanac. Oh, you just cut out. I didn't... I don't know what you said. In, Hello? Pre in previous, in, yes, in previous Tropico games, Caribbean happiness was in the Almanac, but I'm, I'm okay. having trouble finding it here. Okay. Yeah, we were definitely influencing... I, I think there's a multiplayer issue, personally. I think it's multiplayer related. I don't mm -hmm. think it's anything you did. I just think it's I think it's related to some, some kind of outside influence. I'm pretty sure. I came to see you as soon as I found... Oh, it's in happiness. It's in the happy. Yeah, I was there. Um, yeah, it's it's underneath that graph. But mine just says overall happiness in other players. It doesn't say anything about Caribbean happiness. That's uh, where I would. No that's where I would normally find it. Yeah. Oh, maybe mine did. Oh, maybe mine. Yeah, maybe you're right. Then maybe the. I think we influenced each other. I think yeah, that's I what think it is. So. Interesting. Which is stupid, especially <laughs> since we're on the same team. Yeah, that is kind of weird. Cuz my as soon as you left the game, my support, my support went from 70% or so, 80% to 40-50%. Mhm. Mm I don't I don't like that politics determines your support score. I mean, realistically, it's more realistic to real life, but in previous Tropico games, it was tied to happiness. Mm -hmm. And I preferred that, because at least I can control happiness. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I should have just been a rebel. <laughs> a rebel? Yeah. Going around burning your crops. No, I'm oh, thanks. That's nice. Yeah, I would never do that. Say and do nothing or, or just a citizen, just to go on the your circus and your amusement park. Correct. That's nice. <laughs> All right, unemployed twenty five. That's better. I don't think I'm going to get 2 million in this playthrough, honestly. Is it taking too long? 
Well, I mean, it's been three and a half, four hours now, and I, I'm not even the modern era yet. Mm hmm. Like, I bet if I just sit here and let time roll, it would work. Secure this communication. <laughs> just there. Finish espionage, have spy academy. Oh, I can load. Wait. You can what? Oh, I can load your saves. You can load my save? Yeah. Weird. For a single player, I'm assuming, right? Oh, wait a second. Oh, no, you played Tropical 6 on the computer, so it has your saves. Okay. Right. Not just... Because I saw the date, May 31st, September 8th. <laughs> yeah, I don't think those are the correct dates. Trade routes are annoying. Finish espionage. The citizens are demanding elections, President Day. Trying to do something, the camera keeps zooming all over the place. <laughs> Who doesn't love exports? Goods leaving port, money coming back. Heist, Statue of Liberty, increases tourism. Immigrants arriving 100% happy and approve of El Presidente. I like that. Oh. Overall happiness of citizens only takes into account their food and fun happiness. Huh. Well, food should be fine. Yeah, I'll go ahead and host how, that. How do you have no election? What do you mean? In, in a post-colonial era, how do you have no elections? I do have elections in a post-colonial era. But how do you how do you have no elections? Because one of the achievements is have no elections you for 20 years. You can say I will not allow anyone to vote for me. And oh. you, you can basically run a military state, but it's hard to do. You'll, get, it, you'll get attacked constantly. Oh, sweet. <laughs> mm. 
I didn't know you could do that in SimCity 3 or 4. Trifler. I knew that multiplayer was introduced in SimCity 5, but I didn't know that you could do it in 3 or 4. It's been years since I've played them, though, so... Imagine that would be fun though, having two people controlling the same city. That would be rough. That would be fun. I I'd like that. I'm I too controlling. I'm too controlling for that. I'm you not... are, but that's that. That's why it would be fun. You could test your. Oh, like, I am. Am I? Skills. Okay. Oh, you are. You and I both. The world knows you are. <laughs> yeah, I know. I I admit that I am. Fine. Modern times. Over. The future is now present, and the present will present. Our thoroughly modern presidente says the future is now called the present. All right. So who am I going to trade with this time? How many? Five. Five superpowers. Okay. Great. I guess I'll need three more embassies. I just hope none of them invade me, that's all. <sighs> Is this the far- what's the farthest you've gotten? Modern. I've been to modern before. Modern? Not very often because I usually tap out around this time because it is a three, four hour, you know. It's a long time. Yeah. Where's my immigration- or my- um, there we go. Ooh. Uh, we'll do one, two, three. China, Russia. I'll just praise them while I'm here. Now I gotta do trade routes for all five. It's gonna be mm -hmm. annoying. Um, cigar, I see. All of these stink. I guess jewelry, I can do that. I am exporting that. Yeah, I know. Middle East is a superpower. I'm, I'm, I find that hard to believe. Guess oil. Oil. Sugar, I don't need that. Weapons, smart furniture, pharmaceuticals. No. I may need- I might need a, another construction office. I've got, like, I've got one- I've had one construction office since the beginning of the game. Mm -hmm. Alright, fast forward. Jewelry, jewelry, jewelry. Alright, so I just need one for the red. What? The crown? What in the power is- I don't get it. The crown was three eras ago. What the hell does that even- excuse my French. <laughs> doesn't mean- What did you- I said- I got a pop-up. That doesn't make any sense. I don't know what- swear you said that you said excuse my what French. What the heck? I said what the heck. Uh. It's fate of vandalism has been denounced by the palace as <laughs> more grapes. More people- Gorillas are attacking? All right, I've got tanks. I've got forts. I'm sure the good citizens of Tropico and Tech. Hey, President Day, I could use some help. Mostly. Might as well set everything back into defensive mode. Excellent, excellent. I'm so glad this deal worked out for us. 
I have something I would like you to do for me. <laughs> Did that suck? Vlad, okay. It's a landslide, president. What use is power if you don't exercise it? It had wit. All right, shopping mall. How much is that going to set me back? I don't see a shopping mall anywhere. Unless it's under... There it is. Public service? Really? <laughs> Fine. Right next to the coal mine. That's fine. Hey, Presidente, sir. Um, you know how nothing ever turns out like we planned? All right. So you want a hospital? I can do that. Don't be intimidated by the immense power. Visit the China Embassy. Well, you're in the modern war, right? Yep. So now you can play around with different uh, options in the palace customization. Yeah. Oh boy, that's exactly why I did this, so I can... <laughs> All for the benefit of customizing my palace. Yep. You're not terribly popular with my friends, Presidente. Hang gliding? You, Presidente, to have one billion threats? Thanks for your help, Presidente. That hang gliding was somewhere here. There it is. By my calculations, you have improved at least eight of ten metrics I've scribbled down on this napkin. This is business news on Canal Uno. My goal is to make the money I need to win, so I'm going to focus on anything that would... Pharmaceuticals, let's see. Processes oil to produce pharmaceuticals, emits pollution, fashion, cloth and leather to produce apparel. What about office buildings? I could have sworn there were office buildings. Smart furniture. Office, maybe. Profit based on the number of all employed workers. Yeah, I don't think I'll take that. Offshore office. Police blimp. Okay. Don't be intimidated by the immense power. You're a friend of the Earth, Presidente. Expel place. China? No. One day. <sighs> I 
that's good. Hey, President A. Build a fire station. I can do that. Next to the coal mine. There we go. Are you replaying a game? Mm, yeah. <laughs> to see you as soon as I found these were Talk about the issue. Have a courthouse. Certainly, Fine. people are concerned about the issues. Past time someone did something. Generates money for every citizen detained within a dungeon, prism, or asylum. I guess. I don't have a whole lot of them, but let's put that over here somewhere. By my calculations, you have improved at least eight. You are the law, Presidente. Nobody doubts it for a second. Would any of these be of interest to you? It's all strictly... Thanks for your help, President Day. Wait, it's going up again. How did you bring it back up to sixty five? I'm completing. Um, I'm completing requests from different people. Oh. Uh. Are you still playing that other game? Maybe that's why. Why what? Why you didn't know. Yes. <laughs> you weren't paying attention. <laughs> I wasn't. I'm sorry. Uh-huh. And now I'm going back to not paying attention. I'll be back. Thank you. No, fine. Go ahead. <laughs> that's fine. See how it is.
Reports of downtown vandalism are greatly exaggerated. You're not terribly popular with my friends, Presidente. They say the only thing green you're interested in is money. Mind control laces are finally in orbit, Presidente. Reporting in. The blockage has been flashed, all washed and wiped. <laughs> Not every nation is chuck. Agents in Rome have executed Operation Frol. Reporting in. The blockage has been flashed. You put the Earth first and now everyone is happy. How does it feel, Presidente, to have one billion friends? Presidente, the operation is a complete success. Reports of downtown vandalism are great. Security isn't just a word, Presidente. I need your help to make sure Tropico is secure from everything. That's some great firefighting skills right there. A little dinky fire extinguisher for this entire college. Yeah, that, that's gonna work. The citizens are demanding elections, President Dave. What use is power if you don't exercise it? It'd wither away like a muscle you weren't using. Disastrous. Hey, Presidente, buddy, I've been making up some news. I shall be remembered forever. And more. I don't know about you, President, eh, but... You know what made me a success? I did, of course. I'm a self-made man.
Not every nation is Tropico's friend, Prez. Not like I'm... Citizens of Trop. Have you seen the stock prices, President Day? Election is a landslide, Presidente. The metaphorical kind, not the kind. Ah, my friend, the Presidente, the great leader. How go your ambitions? Not stymied, I hope. It seems you did as we requested, although we are still waiting for the proper paperwork to confirm. Is this memorandum accurate? You know, compliance with EU mandates isn't optional. Hmm. you did as we requested although we are still waiting for the proper paperwork is an odd place. It I sometimes wonder about your final confession, Presidente. Opportunities came up. Nothing illegal. Well, nothing that can be proven to break any laws. I knew I could count on you to do the. Can we talk about the issues, President Day? Pleasure doing business with you, President Day.
What use is power if you don't exert? You act with great conviction. These superpowers are extremely annoying because, like, I, I'm trying to save money so I can make my two million goal, but they keep demanding things, and if I don't cater to them, they're gonna get mad at me. So it's like it's slowing down the rate at which I'm actually generating money, and that's annoying. What happened to my... Trying to complete this trade route too, but there, I'm just don't. There's not enough days to do it. Poor people simply don't understand the pressures of wealth. Its spokesperson said. I don't know. I think I'm content to leave it at this. Um, I've got plenty of money. Yeah, I didn't reach my two million goal, but I'm a feeling I would if I spent another hour or two doing this. But it's already nine o'clock at night, and I've had my fill. So there you go, folks. Um, I'm gonna consider this a win, considering. How well I'm doing, how much money I have. Uh, Two million is just outrageous to ask for. And again, that scales based off of the co-op mode. If you set it to one million dollars as your goal when you have a co-op partner, then um, it'll scale up to two million. So I'm, I'm fairly certain I would have reached two million given enough time. So there you go. Um, if you guys haven't already, subscribe to me on Twitch and YouTube. That way you can stay up to date with any new content I've been to publish. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time.